Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest <laughs> Atari games and the cutest kitties. Oh, hi kitten, this is Atari. That is Sprite. And we're going to be playing some 7800 games, some fresh new homebrew. Woo! There we go. <laughs> so tonight we are going to be playing Bubble Bobble. A brand new version. Brand, brand, brand new as of 30 minutes ago. Brand new. <laughs> um, by Old Style, who's in the chat, and Bobby Clark, who did the music since nice. Papalooza. We're also going to be playing Balance uh, by Fulton Bot, a Rainbow by Carrie Caxonen, who's in the chat as oh, well. Oh, very nice. And also Night Guy in Another Castle <gasps> has been updated. So we're going to play that because it's got a new boss. Nice. Let's see if we can make it to Hopefully the new boss. Hopefully we can get to the new boss, yeah. We did. We made it to the end last <laughs> time, so I think I think we have a good chance. Okay. Cats good. are going nuts. Um, but before we get to that... Oh, yes. My shirt. <laughs> and socks. Yes. Yeah. Let's switch over to the socks. Look at them. What are they? It's Yay. Bob and Bob. Bring it this over way, a little bit. This way. Yay. It's Bob and Bob in sock form. <laughs> And I wore this because of all the fruit nice. on it. Yeah. Because there's lots of fruit in Bubble Bobble. There you go. There we go. <laughs> um, but before we get to the games, I want to thank all the Twitch subscribers. Down here. 8-Bit Poet, uh, Enter Atari, Armscar Coder, Atari Dunder Dexel Rules, Atari Nation 74, Atari Age, Bartarius Maximus, Beef Supreme, Bia Procock, Bruno Stooks, uh, Calf Man 2D, Chelsea Donamal, Charles Lund, Chitlala, Cole Patch, Crazy Curtis, Cyrano Reboot, Dianoid, Debola Dona, Debola Dona, Donna, uh, DJ Lemon Fresh. Oh, that's a new name. Nice. Dr. Moo Cows, Gamma Dev, Great Defender, Ground Trooper, uh, Geraldo Huju, uh, Johnny WC, Carl G. Croco, Kveltifer, Lambda Express, Lord Kraken, Mark Giannis, Mark Spacing, Mick Muse, Mike Saul, Mike Cattell, Miss Command, MK Swift, Mr. Zarnu, Mr. Fix, Nathan Strum, Neomenia, Nostalgic Packrat, Quahog, RC70, Render Ghost, Supremes, VD Revan, Thule, Rod Castler, Smitty B. Spicer, Spinley, S. Ramirez, D. Train, Tiki Dan, K. T. Fos, TM Events, Vexor X, and VVG Double Down, and before the sh slowest name read ever. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, and just before the show, a whole bunch of people subscribed, including Carrie Cack, uh, Charles Wheeland, uh, Al Nefer, and Dan AVC. Thank you. Thank you so much awesome. for supporting the show and supporting these cats who yeah. are going insane. I know. They're really, really hungry. They're like, oh my God, we need our <laughs> treats so bad. Give me the treats. Yeah, he does, He should be at a tiki bar. That's, I would like yeah. I would like to be in a place where this shirt is appropriate. <laughs> right now it's <laughs> it's threatening to snow for the next it's couple days. At, well, the next, Our yeah. first snow. It's no of it, the year. No, no, it's snowed. It's snowed well, on not uh, here it didn't. Well, where I work it snowed. Yeah. Um, yeah. should we do like, treat time now? Sure. Yeah. Let's do treat time do before treat time. the news. Get, okay, cats. Get it in. Are you get excited? It in. Let's move these out of the way. Close the door. Yeah. Where's the other bell? Where's the bell? <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, they're raring to go. Are okay. you? Let's get the uh, let's get the betting going here. Place your bets on cat races. Thank you, RC70. Yes, thank you for starting the cat races. The cats say thank you. Place your bets. Place your bets. Place your bets. The cats are ready. We have two cats here. The cat bookies need their cut. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, I think these are the cat books. I, I don't know. I don't. Um, yeah. <laughs> so this this is this is Sprite. Oh, I'll be in trouble. <laughs> this is Sprite, and he's a very fast eater, but gets distracted. And that's Atari. He's too far for me to pick up. I can pick him up. And uh, he is a very slow eater, but uh, he's a very strong bell ringer when he gets to the bell. Yeah. This guy kind of fumbles around a little bit. He does. Um, so let's put up the cat treat. Up on the screen, reset the points to zero, and see how the predictions are going. Excellent. Oh, oh okay. Atari. Nothing. Mm. nothing. Yeah. Who's who's got? Yeah, Atari one yeah. to two. Atari People think two. he's People hungry really today. People think he's 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 uh, he's due. I think he is. I think he's he is he's due. pretty hungry today. Although yeah. there's there's uh, a few people there bet, uh, betting on Sprite for the well, solid win. He's the safe bet. He is. Um, but uh, you never know. Atari might be able to pull it off. Yeah. Oh, listen oh, to that. Oh, that is an Atari. Uh, that is an that? Atari who's ready to be fed. Oh, he put his pop and went. <laughs> yeah, he is ready. He's just off camera though. Yeah. Um, but you might have seen him. 
Yeah. There. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll see see how he performs. Based on that, you got about thirty seconds to pick your cat yeah. and pick how much you think they're going to win by. You think they're going to win by, and how much you want to bet on them. Yeah. Oh, there. he is. He is, is somebody going to sneak in? Oh, somebody snuck in nope. with the Atari Three Plus. Just put their dollar on that. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it is. Hundred points. Hundred channel points. They're not worth anything. They're worth bragging rights, and they're worth um, you know feeding the cats too. That's right. Because if you earn those points, you can actually spend them on triggering treat time. <laughs> That's right. Or catnip yeah. as well. You can also uh, give them some There's catnip. There's no betting on catnip. No betting on catnip. No. It's just a reward. Yeah. Uh, has Tari become more vocal since you introduced the betting? Mm. He's not very no. vocal. No. Sprite is the meower, meower, meower. And oh he's gotten God. more and more meowy as just he's gotten older too. terrible in the yeah. morning. <laughs> okay. It's time. Let's do it. Where's the bells? Mm. Where'd you put the bells? Okay. Are you ready, everyone? To cheer ready. on your cat Let that you bet on? Okay, cats, to your stations. No, you're all discombobulated. Okay. You're like right in the way. Okay. Oh get, my God, get up. Get, get up. Out of the way. Get you're up. interfering. Your butt's in the way. There okay. we go. There oh, go. sorry oh. for the start. Oh. Who's oh, that, that oh. was Sprite. Sprite one each. Well. Okay, one each. Okay. There we go. And they're off. Vicious circle of cat gambling. There you go. Oh, that another was Sprite. one for Sprite. Oh, oh Atari. Atari's close oh. behind. Oh, oh my Sprite. God. Oh, my gosh. Did you gosh. eat it? What is happening? <laughs> <laughs> oh, too soft. You want to oh, oh, Sprite again. One for Sprite. Oh, another Atari. One for Atari. They're hungry. They are hungry for the win. Very hungry. Sprite. You're like inhaling it, buddy. <laughs> Sprite again. Are you even chewing? No, them? no, hit the bell. No, hit the bell. Hit the bell. Good there kitty. You go. Atari. Atari's doing strong ringings oh, today, Sprite but Sprite's is a bit faster. So fast. He, he does inhale them. Yeah. Atari. And Atari's, you know, catching up a little bit. Oh, but, I oh. was trying to run away with it now. There oh, we go. Sprite. Sprite. Seven to five for Sprite. He's he's well ahead. Two oh, plus. Atari. Good job. Atari's very close behind. If he just put his mind Sprite. to it. Sprite. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I was just going to say, if Atari put his mind to it, he could catch up. But, but, uh, That's Atari. He's just a little bit too far behind. Oh, oh, Sprite. A very soft ding, oh, but that oh. puts him in. Game, Game point. point. And it's oh, over. Sprite. No, it's over. Oh, here, have a couple extras. There you go. It's all go. over. There we go. What yep. is it? Three plus. Was it? Yeah. Oh, just. Three plus for Sprite. Just snuck in. Wow. So, let's see who got that. <laughs> wow. Sprite by three whiskers. Choose the outcome. Oh, Charles. <laughs> Sprite by three whiskers. And the big winner is uh, Atari 800 XL Rules. Split. Yeah. With three others. Splitting a pot with three others. 40,000 bits. Heavy betting today. Yeah. Very heavy betting. <laughs> wow. Gamble, gambles. <laughs> Charles Wheatland. People aren't holding I back see. today. Yeah. Mm. Okay. So, uh, <laughs> let's open the mail. I've got some mail here. Let's see what I know already it is. <laughs> but you don't know what it is. Ken oh. may, have, may have forgotten what it is. I, I probably have. Yeah. Did I order it? You didn't order it. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, why would I know what it is in the first place? You'd be opening it if you ordered it. That's true. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's very well packaged. Thank goodness. Yeah. I always like the wrap the entire oh. package in tape method of securing um, mm. the package. Very hard to get <laughs> into, but... This one's not too bad. does insulate it and protect it from water damage. So. It does. Uh, Which this was delivered in the rain. It was wet when it was dropped. Oh off. no, Carl G's having a rough go. Oh no. I'm going to be destitute before long <laughs> if this pattern holds. You just Holds gotta, style, it's cheese. <laughs> what I would do is bet on the outside a little bit. Like lower your bet, bet on like the three pluses. Well. Or whatever people aren't betting. And then maybe you can win it back. Back in the black. Uh, woo. <laughs> Charles Whelan has uh, stole all your all your money. Fortunately, Charlie. with this betting, I don't think you can actually get in the red. <laughs> uh, you no, can't just, spend what you don't have. It just goes to zero. <laughs> it just goes to and zero. And while you watch, it goes up. So. Yeah, thank goodness. I don't want to be responsible for anyone mortgaging their home. Oh, so. God. No. <laughs> okay. What is this? Oh, come on. Ooh, ooh, I think it I do know what this is. The Pow Kitty. <laughs> oh, wow. 
Not kitty, kitty. Oh, it should be pal kitty. I know. That'd be so so much cuter. <laughs> I have little whiskers on the oh, side. Oh, there you go. They need rebranding. They should have come to us. <laughs> yes. Uh, this is the Pow Kitty RGB 30. Um, oh, it's completely... Oh, what is this? It's just a foam protector. Maybe. Yeah, just oh, protects it. Oh, it is a foam protector. <laughs> nice. I'm like, why is it shaped like that? Wow. Um, this is something I've wanted for a little bit mm. after finding out about Pico 8 games. Mm. And I've talked about Pico 8 games on the show before. Now, Pico 8 games... Well, Pico 8 is an emulator for a system that never existed, a console that never existed. Mm. They term it a fantasy <clears throat> console. Um, and the games are awesome looking. They are right up my alley and probably everyone else's alley as well out mm. there. Um, because they're all like eight bit here's the here's the actual Ooh, handheld. yeah you have to show that off get yep. get right up in I'm there get really close up yep. go oh. back to the cat cam there there we go it is nice looking it is. i like the form factor for some reason in the photos i thought it was bigger uh, but it yes. is quite a small handheld i thought it was i was picturing like a steam deck almost oh, or God. a switch That's you know big. like a much bigger no you don't need it that it's big. quite nice the, the, like this does do everything. It's not just for Pico 8. Okay. It, it does all the things that all those other mini nice. handhelds do. It is quite a nice Emulates size. through MAME. I can play all the Atari systems on this, etc, etc. Yeah, but that's excellent. this plays Pico 8. Mm. Um, something the analog um, handheld, mm. analog uh, pocket, pocket, does not do. It cannot run Pico 8, which oh. I was very disappointed in. Yeah. Um, it just isn't set up for something like that. Um, and I bought this one. Other That's ones can nice. emulate it, but this this specifically has the one by one aspect ratio, which you almost never see. Yeah. Because the Pico Eight is a one by one aspect ratio. Okay. Um, so the stats on it. Let's see. Uh, <laughs> I want to see it. It's a seven twenty by seven twenty resolution. The Pico Eight has a one twenty eight by one twenty eight resolution. Yeah, it's good. It's nice clicky buttons. Yeah. I really like yep, that. Soft. Um, but they're every, they're solid. Sorry. Everything I've they're seen solid. Uh, looks really good. It's gotten amazing reviews, which is why nice. I bought it. Um, I just opened it, so <laughs> I haven't I haven't actually f not much. One twenty eight by one twenty eight. No, but it's not what you think. One twenty eight by one twenty eight. The power behind those pixels is astounding. Mm. Like take the links, the power of the links, and like multiply it by ten. It can do anything with those dots, pretty much. Like anything you want, it can do. Um, yeah. It's, How is the heft of it? It's not that heavy. It's not heavy, but it's not light. Well, it's kind of right in the middle. It's got a really like nice. Makes the twenty six hundred seem ultra high res. Yeah, it's one sixty by one ninety two. Is it one twenty eight? Yeah. Or uh, the twenty six hundred. It's certainly, even though it looks somewhat brick shaped, it it is not very heavy, but it does have weight. Like it does, it does weigh your hand down a little yeah. bit you know it's not so light that you're gonna drop it so if anybody's heard of the game celeste that's and nice. you probably have that's where this that game originated was on this handheld is celeste like it was that. one of the kind of premier games on on the system and there's a lot of uh arcade translation arcade ports mm -hmm. for the system and they look great i'm very um, excited i believe well it should play at five times resolution but there is settings you can expand it i'm not going to i'm going to use a a, a multiplier of five obviously um, but it can stretch to 720 by 720 um, and it uses there's different um, emulators or front ends you can use for it um, but i am going to play with it tonight mm -hmm. oh my god and another interesting fact is has two sd slot card slots mm. One is for the operating system, one is for the games. So that when you update the operating system, you don't have to just wipe out your games every time. Nice. Which is so nice. That's it's, really smart. And then you, yep. you can just take it out, yep. drop the software on it, or, yep. or, update or the, the OS. system, or update the OS and pop it back in. Yep. And you that don't touch really the convenient. games whatsoever. Yep. Anyway, that's, that's enough convenient. of me trying to sell this. And I don't know. <laughs> I'm not trying to sell you on it. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> he hasn't played it yet. No. So, <laughs> but it's, it does look got, really nice. It's got Wi-Fi. Yeah. on it so you can update it over the air you don't have to plug it in but i just um, like the form factor of it because yeah. i really like that style of 
handhelds oh, yes. with the screen in the it's middle and like size the switch, the 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 yeah. um, the Steam Deck. Like they all have that kind of style. Yeah. But to hold on either side of the screen is really nice. I also like has Bluetooth, so you can do it remotely, and it has HD output built in. So you can hook it up to your TV oh, and wow. it becomes a console. Nice. It can be so console. So you can Bluetooth controllers to it and, and, and yep. play games. So you Lovely. can play it on the big screen. Very nice. Oh, I'm so excited. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Um, let's see. Anything else about it? No. Okay. Uh, I think there was a Pico 8 port to the Lynx a long time. What? What? What do you mean Pico 8 port? The, the emulator of... Pico 8 on the links? I'll have to look at that. See the association. Pow, Pow Kitty. Uh, Carl G said I missed the name of your device. Oh, I don't Pow, know if you saw that. Um, Pow Kitty. Captain Classic as oh let me I'll yeah. link it to uh, yeah. for you if you guys want to check it out. Yeah. Um, and this is directly from them. There's other places you can buy it, but this is I found their website is is cheap, so uh, about as cheap as anywhere else. There you go. Um, so the Atari Homebrew Awards have unofficially started. <laughs> unofficially. As of Sunday. It's okay. not the public part of it. Oh, okay. Fair um, enough. Well. The yeah. spreadsheets and the voting has started for the uh, nomination Nominees. committee. Excellent. Um, so they're narrowing it down to six. For uh, each category? Six for each category. Nice. We expanded the Atari 8 bits. 8-bit uh, slash 5200 categories by two. Mm -hmm. We've separated them out into ports and uh, into originals because there was enough to support that. And probably next year we might even go into, we probably will, go into graphics and sound for Atari 8-bit as well. Mm. Um, because there's just as many um, games being developed for the Atari 8-bit as there are for the 2600, which was the big, big category that's always been the big category. Um, so that's I've been very very busy <laughs> past week super super busy so if you've messaged me um I haven't got back to you <laughs> because <laughs> I've been just getting that out I just finished the last bits of the um packaging mm. spreadsheet today and also the um lifetime achievement award Mm. today as well which is only for the nomination committee got a bit of sauce oh do i there yeah you got it um <laughs> eating pizza <laughs> pizza it's pizza night um so they're gonna really? narrow it down is it gone yep it's gone okay good um unlikely likes would have a tough time running lua yeah i that's what i think not enough ram well that one that is a one meg of ram or something let's see what does it say one one gig of ram so I don't know if the Lynx is up to that. Mm. I don't know if he uses one gig. Anyway, I'll, I'll have to check that out. Um, so they're going to be deliberating on those for three weeks and uh, narrowing it down to the top six. I'm very excited. Um, then I move on to the next stages of organizing. That was the big organization. Getting that also. also. Narrowing it down. Um, people have uh, um, typed out some corrections for okay. my spreadsheet because there's always corrections well yeah because there's literally hundreds of games i have to organize mm -hmm. so there's always mistakes that i make so obviously these people are very intimately familiar with all of the games, <laughs> the games which is why there is a nomination committee yes so they can say hey you missed this or this is wrong or this is wrong but i will get back to those questions for there are people in the nomination committee in the chat i'll get back to that tomorrow and start catching up yep Oh, Lynx emulator for the Pico 8. Well, mm, Lynx emulator for handhelds, yes. Um, I'm not sure how the two connect, but... Um, Harpy's Curse on the VCS. Ooh. So Harpy's Curse has now is now out on the VCS. Uh, VCS 800, I guess, is the more... Um, less confusing term for it. <laughs> okay. um, so along with his uh, other three games, Todd Fermansky's... Uh, Dragon Trilogy, Dragon Trilogy, and Harpy's Curse for the 7800 are now on the VCS if you want to play it on that console. And uh, hook it up to your television through HDMI if you've got that. So um, Atari continues to support the homebrew community, which is great. Good to hear. I like seeing homebrew coming to the VCS. It's mm -hmm. another avenue for people to play these games. So mm -hmm. it's really, really great. Um, that's all the news. 
um, that I have. The cat's like sitting behind your head. He was chewing on my hair for a while. Oh, yeah. And he just he got was, fed, though. He was playing with Totoro in the back here. Silly, silly, silly. Yeah. There oh, he so he usually Totoro. chews on this thing. There we go. Yeah, he was Maybe chewing on that. I don't know what he's chewing up to. Chewing on the to. star. I don't know what he's up to back there. He's, uh, he's so, you know, cat spiracies and all. So. Oh, yeah. They're yeah, bad, who knows? bad cats. Yeah. <laughs> so it's time to play our first game. Bubble Bobble. Yay! Uh, I'm so this excited. is an update. Uh, Old Style sent this to me half an hour before the show. Thank Very you so nice. much, Old Style. Uh, so this build is from today. It's a 256 game. Uh, Old Style's made Bubble Bobble, uh, Luna Patrol, and a game that has the initials MB. Uh, Mirror Brothers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so let's pop that in. We'll just call it Luigi and Friends from now Luigi on. Luigi and Friends. <laughs> yeah. Could be any Luigi. Yes. We don't know. No, there's lots of Luigis out in the world. Yep. Lots of Luigis. That's why I'm wearing this shirt. Lots of Luigis socks. who aren't, you know, don't have plumbers. trademarks next to their names. That's you right. Know? Could be any plumbers. <laughs> uh, let's see. There we go. Mustache Brothers. Mustache Brothers. Those famous Mustache Brothers. That's right. Oh, and I also got a case as well. Oh, oh yeah. For Does the Pal well? Kitty. Ha -ha. Uh, so let's see. Put it in. You want to. This let's is it. See. Click on this wait, wait, one. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Ooh, very nice. Yes. It does fit very nicely. Nice. And I, and it I know. It goes under that, right? Yeah, it does. So I might as well put it in now. Very nice. There we go. It's got a screen protector that I need to apply. Nice. Uh, wait. You'll want to wipe off the my fingerprints that are now on the front of it. So. Yes. <laughs> Sorry. Touching the screen. I don't touch know if screen. it's a touch screen. I'm not sure. No, I, I don't, don't think so. Well, we'll see. Okay, let's load it up. Plumber Panic. I like that one too. Plumber Panic. Yeah. Let's load it up. Um. Sorry, this is 7,800. <laughs> yes, this wow. is 7,800. Nice. Yeah, gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Wow. So this, not this version, but the version before was posted mm -hmm. December 31st, I think. And he posted, it says, it's time to end the 2023 with a pop. It's had a big update since the Zero Page Homebrew reveal with the addition of two more rounds, <gasps> eight and nine. Nice. Bonus rounds. And practically all of the power-ups have been mapped with special abilities or events. There's certainly a minor bug or two since all of the focus was shuffling content in. The game itself is still pretty raw and not quite optimized or finished in certain areas, so occasionally there'd be brief slowdown and graphic artifacts where things get hot and heavy. But generally speaking, it controls uh, well, is very playable, and very BB-like. Mm. Uh, so, uh, yeah, go for it. Oh, thank you, Esther Ramirez, for hey, resubscribing. Yes, Ramirez! 54 months. I, I can't wrap my head around yeah. 54 months. <laughs> So, yeah. Now I will join in after talking about the updates. Uh, for those unfamiliar, gameplay consists of shooting, trapping, popping, trap mobs, and popping trapped monsters, and most importantly, eating as many delicious treats as you can. Popping multiple monsters at the same time is a combo, adding more points. A combo of three or more will also spawn a random extend. Letters which go towards earning one up or spawning staffs. Uh oh. Bonus items. Oh, there we go. Uh, ah. Bonus point items and special power up items spawn early in rounds. If you blaze through rounds quickly, then it's possible to miss out on power up and special items before they spawn. So get the most out of the demo, just wait until they appear. After several playthroughs, the timing and where items spawn will be seared into your brain. Uh, at the moment, there's not much in the sound department other than the theme music, courtesy of Synth Papalooza. Uh, one final note, the left difficulty switch controls how special items are dropped. So, on A... Let's see what they are right now. Okay. They're on B right now. So on A, normal item mode, special power-up items spawn based on in-game happenings. Uh, we're on B, so special item tour iterates through each item, one per round, starting at the Red Cross. So this is probably the more interesting thing, uh, way to set it, so we get to see more of the special items. Oh, that was close. 
Uh, I play this exclusively under emulation. However, as far as I know, it should work with the 1700 GD and possibly the Dragonfly. We're playing on the 1700 GD. Even though a lot of work and content went into this, there's still a long way to go. The next demo is likely to be rounds 10 through 19, hopefully with the addition of more monsters and fire, water slide, and lightning utility. So I can see why the water slide is a big upgrade, because that acts very differently than anything else. Um, enjoy and Happy New Year! Um, and also he posted there, yes, there are a few quirks. On occasion, the round might hang and won't advance as you've seen. Other instances, it looks like it might happen, but then it continues on. Usually that's after one uh, of the nuke all monster events, water, big bolt, fireballs, etc. Other times you get a few events that uh, occur right when hurry up pops. Then it looks like the game outright freezes, but more often than not, it keeps going. At times, bubbles could end up being pushed into a wall or beneath the floors too. So then they're just in limbo falling indefinitely. Uh, and this new update, he says, uh, small tune-up added lightning bubbles. So those are brand new, the lightning bubbles. That's exciting. Have you been able to kill a monster with a lightning bubble yet? Uh, I killed something with fire. Okay. I'm not sure how the lightning bubbles work, so. Oh, you just pop them and they shoot out to the side and they kill the monsters. Uh, various bug and performance tweaks, uh, more credits, eight total and easier difficulty. Trap monster bubbles take longer to pop. Uh, seems to play a little slow. Is this a PAL version? Nope, this, this is the NTSC version. Further enough. Oh, it has to be the NTSC version. I do not have a PAL 7800, nor do many people. That's, that's pretty, pretty rare to have a PAL 7800. Uh, Esmeralda says, this game sounds and looks great. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Carl G says the cute is strong with this one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Round nine. So this should be the last... Ah. The throwing boulders. This should be the last level that's been put into the game. Oh, see, so snuck one in. Okay. I should be able to join in. There I am. Hi. 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 Time to... Oh. 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 Well, it didn't hurt me. So no, that's good. good. Just stun me, which is good. Back to level one. Level one. So he level recommends one. not to finish as quick. So don't pop everything. Leave that oh. last guy. Oh my goodness. Oh, we got some bonus. Oh. To collect all the flowers. You must have, one of us must have hit something. I guess so. I am not familiar with all the power ups on this. There's oh, yeah? so many things you can collect in this game. So let's not kill everything in this. So leave one, leave one guy. Oh, it's that green stuff. Oh, that's what it does. Okay, the bottle triggers the, um, this time it's blowers. Can I get that one? Oh, just. Get it, get it, get it. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs> How is the flicker on actual TV? It's totally fine. Um, you can see some, uh, don't get that bottle. It'll end the round. Oh, the bottle up there? Yeah, that that gives the whole screen thing. So don't get don't get that guy. Don't. Oh, oh. No, where are we supposed to be doing? Not just leaving one guy because there's power ups that come on the screen. Oh, when when there's one left and it gets he well, gets just all red. If you finish it too early, um, oops. If you finish the game too early, it won't spawn oh. the uh, the extra stuff. Oh, get that, get that, get that, get that. Oh, it stuns them all. Ah, okay. <gasps> Bananas. Muffins. Muffins and a peach. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, you got the peach. Bananas. Oh. I want to see if this guy gets, dies with the lightning bolt. Oh, no. I'm dead. <gasps> no, it went the wrong way. Don't get that guy. Don't get that last red guy. Oh, look at that! It's stunning both of us over and over. Because <laughs> I guess it bounces. When it hits something, it bounces the opposite way. Don't get that guy. Don't get him. Don't get him. Run away! Uh, I'm guessing the ghost, uh, the hurry-up ghost, is not in this yet. 
You know that guy, right? Yeah. Oh, ah! oh he is! Oh my god. Run away from the hurry up ghost. Are we waiting for something? Um, I think we can go ahead now. Actually, I want to see if I can die on the hurry up ghost. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. I've seen that wallpaper pattern in my mom's old kitchen. I'm guessing the, uh, the clover oh, no. one. Get him. Can't on this level. Oh, now I can. Oh. Wee! I can't wait for the water. You go, wee! Oh, yeah, it's so yeah, much yeah. Fun. I love the water. <laughs> after you finish this mode, you'll have a backlog of power ups and switching after switching to the normal game. Oh, what's that chest? Oh, just points. Oh, damn it. I'm in your last life. Um, Me? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So do you get to continue if you die? Or is it like over, over? Or is it like the Don't arcade know. where you put I in a virtual I, quarter? Well, you just keep, yeah, you keep going. I would you want me so. to die? Um, yes. You can die. Yeah. Dead. Ooh, I've got one life left. Run. Okay, start up again. Yep, okay. Yeah, good. Okay. Good. So, can I switch to midstream? To B? Ooh, I got a huge popsicle. Did you? Yeah, it just went. Oh, nice. Very so I've cool. switched to B now. Okay. Oh, I, oh, I guess I wasn't looking last time. One time. Stage eight. There are eight credits. Oh, eight credits. Okay, so it does end. Eight's, eight's pretty good. Eight's a lot of credits. Watermelon! Watermelon! <laughs> I got the thing on my shirt! Watermelon bingo! Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> okay, don't get that guy. Oh! Whoa! Screen clearing. Get him! No, it missed him. Ah, oh, got him. Nice. <gasps> so awesome. Okay, don't get don't get one of the guys. Oh, oh too late. <gasps> French fries! We bubble bubble bu fries! Bubble bubble fries. Lots of sprites to manage and survives with the chaos. Yeah, it's okay, careful. Just leave them be. Leave them be. All of them? Leave them be. No! <laughs> That's fine. Oh, you already got, got a D. The, the thing. Oh, and an N, and a T, and an X! Nice. Ooh, so many letters. It's good to get letters. Oops. Yep, there's very little <sighs> slowdown. Have you noticed any slowdown in the game? Me? Yes, you. Not the cats. <laughs> Have you noticed any slowdown in the game? Um. I haven't noticed any. It's a little slower than the last time. We there it is. <gasps> Yum. Oh, 10,000 points. It feels a little slower than last time no, we played. No, no, slow down. Oh, not slow down, no. No, I haven't seen any slow down. No. Which is good. Okay, don't get the last guy. Don't get that red guy. Run away from him. Don't get that juice. Oh, oh. The, he got well, zapped. That answers that question. Yeah. The zap. I've got more util extend uh, bubbles coming out. So that's what I, what I want to see is um, see if we can go oh, get the clock. <gasps> Stun Froze him. him. Do I die if I touch him? Yes. <laughs> but you can blow a bubble on him while he's stunned. Okay, don't get that guy. No? Oh, no. I want to get um, bonuses. Or actually, oh, sorry. Oh, we didn't oh, get him. Because he's already, he's in a bubble. In a bubble. He's protected in a bubble. Interesting. Oh, he's about to come out. Watch out. Watch out! Oh no, you got him and popped the bubble. I it's okay. To. I had to. I was in danger. I agree, Carrie. Very well made game. Don't pop them. Nope. What was the shoe? Get that shoe. Woo, shoe! Does it make you faster? I thought the shoe did make. Oh, that was close. Stunned. I thought the shoe made you oh, sorry. run faster. Just trying to get one, not the other. No, doesn't seem to. Just gives you something. Ah. 
I don't remember if those little bolts popped trapped monsters. Speed boost. So it, it does give you a speed boost. You shouldn't notice one. Ah, oh, it's always been my dream to have Bubble Bobble on the 7800. It's so awesome. <laughs> and it's apparently very well suited for the system. Like, it's handling it really, really well. You know, there's... You had to introduce a little bit of flicker, but you don't really... You, you don't notice it. Like, you can see it if you're, like... Obviously, if you're looking for it, but in the middle of playing, you don't see the flicker. Because he's concentrated on the bubbles, the flicker not the active characters walking around, which is obviously the right choice. Stunned! Oh, uh, they're not really stunned, because they're in the bubbles! Bubbles don't get stunned. Which is probably the better choice. Don't get them. Don't touch them. What? Don't touch them. No. I like how he's looking back and forth. Oh, oh he is! Out. Let me out! Oh, nice! Let me out! He's gonna get out. He's at, getting angry. Oh. Purple. Now it's red. Oh, he's so angry. Oh, there's a little bit of a glitch. There's one to investigate, old style. Oh, <laughs> oh it's still there. Something. Still there. Okay. I'm just on the bottom rail. Oh, hurry uh, up! No. I want those extend things. bubbles. How how do you get the extend bubbles? I can't remember. You set it in here. Um. Nope. Oh. Oh, it doesn't say in here. How do you get extend? Oh, there it is. A combo of three or more. Oh, so you have to combo them. Okay, so don't pop them individually. Wait till they all get to the top. Oh, I'm popping them, of course. Okay, so there's three or more. Oh, oh, are they gathering? Okay, I'm gonna pop them. There we go. Extend bubbles, where are you? Lies. Vicious lies. <laughs> okay, don't pop them. Don't touch them. Don't touch them, don't no. touch them, don't touch them. Oh, there's... Oh, maybe it's on the next level. There's an E. Oh, there you go. There's a D. One more E. You can have that D. I just need an E. Ah, oh, damn it. Did I get that guy? No, that was only two guys. Or was it three? No, it was uh -huh. only two. I'm trying to pop three uh -huh. or more. Oh, disappeared. Ooh, beer. 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 No beer tonight? No. No, hmm? San Pellegrino tonight. Yeah. Yeah, just San Pellegrino. Hey, don't pop these guys. Don't. Ah! Ah, no, I accidentally popped them. Okay, I gotta shoot. It does speed you up. It does. Quite a yeah. bit faster. You will have this music in your head for the rest of the <laughs> night. Probably. Okay, don't pop them. Oh my god, I tell you to pop, not pop them, and I do yeah, it. Yeah, you're very bad at <laughs> not I get taking too close your own advice. Them. I get too close to them. That's the problem. Okay, this is a perfect top. Oh my god! Okay, there's three. Perfect. Wait till they gather. Wait. Wait. Now. Yes. And then the extend comes in the next level. Does it? Oh, it's been working. At the end of the next level. Or not? Well, maybe not. Maybe I didn't Where's quite our... get them all at the same time. Or... Yeah, they were kind of close, but wait till they come to the bottom. Okay. Let's see, is that close enough? Uh, uh, is that a combo? <laughs> I kind of. Or do they all have to trigger from one hit? Oh, we'll see Thank soon. You. Oh, he's licking my arm. Oh, oh you're so cute. Oh, he's the cutest Is it tasty? Little baby. Okay, wait. Do it. Do it. Oh, that's five. That's definitely got it. Gotta give us extend bubbles. Just want an E. E. I mean, we don't have any credits on the screen. It doesn't actually show them, so... Lies! Where does, where's the extend? Oh, something just popped in and out of existence there. 
little tiny sucker. Anything 8K and up. Oh, so it has to... Be... Oh, there it is. There's my E. Get your E. Get your E. Oh, I did. Get your E. Oh. Nope. Come on. There you go. Didn't work. Extend? I don't know. Maybe it's a different color E. It's have to be a... Oh, it was a red E. Oh, I have to get a green E. Oh, I didn't know that there was different colors for each person. Oh, I should have let you get it then. Need the green each, Chalcedony Mouse says. I was not aware of that. Uh, obviously, I just um, I just enjoy Bubble Bubble. <laughs> without knowing, <laughs> without too much knowing about much it about it. <laughs> ah, damn it! I gotta get my E. Oh, big cool. But this is looking so good. Fantastic. So good. It plays Always makes so me want well. ice cream. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Hi, kitten. Which Is cat there? licked you? Oh, this guy? no, the black kitten got up here and licked, licked my hand. Being very funny. Don't pop it. Uh... Oh, my God. Oh, he popped it. Was there three of them? Yeah. Ooh. I need my greenie. Your greenie? Not With my your greenie. Greenies? Need a green E. So this uh, version of the game will be posted uh, after the show. So if you want to get the updated version, um, updated from the one that was posted on December 31st of last year. Wait, 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 wait. Now, yeah. it might have worked. Um, it will be available soon in the Atari Age forums. Um, just tea? Oh, a T was coming down there. Oh, oh no. You need the teeth. There's an N. Is that an N? There's an E. Oh, as, no, it's no E. It's an X. There's uh, a T. You can get the T. I just need a green E. Oh. I have a green E. Ah, ah, ah. Don't want to pop those. No. Did, oh, it might have worked. Might have worked, but I'm not sure. Don't think so, though. So we're just trying to get the all the bonuses. Yep. Just once. Okay. Do it. Yeah. Oh yeah, that was lots of points. That must have worked. Sixteen thousand. There we go. So if there's a greenie, it's for you. Yes, please. If it's anything but a greenie, you can have it because I've got all the other letters. That definitely was three in a row. 8,000. Is that enough points? Can't remember. 8,000 and up. Okay. There it is. There's the greenie. No, don't die. Okay. I gotta get it. Gotta get it. Got it. There we go. Woo! Woo! It worked. And goes to the next level. Okay. All right. Wow, that is a huge. Um, level up for this game mm -hmm. um it works so so well um uh super catchy music mm -hmm. so yeah it didn't crash <laughs> good job old thumbs style. up <laughs> great job so like i said that's going to be available this version is going to be available in the atari age forums go to the 7800 forum and look for uh bb mm. it's to obfuscate the uh actual name of it Okay, so let's move on to the next game. And the next game is... Balance by Steve Fulton. This was first uh, posted December 22nd. 128K game. Uh, Steve Fulton has also made the game Into the Void, Iron Grip, A Destroyer of Worlds, and also Last Stand Halloween, which we played recently as well, and Number Crusher. Okay. Let, all right. All right. So let's switch over that and go for it. And we are using the 7800 a GD game drive, mm -hmm. uh, which has um, RGB output which is why it looks so gorgeous. Um, so 
he posted this December 22nd. It says a new game in alpha that may never be finished. The video explains it all. So he posts a video along with it. Okay. Um, it's kind of a sad story, so get prepared. Oh, no. Yeah. Uh, things happen. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so he posted a five-minute video that explained his motivation behind making this game. Okay. And I've, I've transcribed a portion of the text from the video okay. so I can read it out because it's not... Rather than show the video? Yeah. Um, yeah. You guys can watch it. There's much more to the video than what I'm going to say. Okay. Um, it says, Balance is an experiment for the Atari 7800 created after my friend Brandon died of brain cancer last November. Uh, Br Brandon was one of my oldest friends. We met in junior high at 12 years old. He was the first person I knew who had a ColecoVision. He was our GM for role-playing games. He was the most mm -hmm. creative person that I ever knew. There are three types of stones in balance. You can start it up. Let me just make sure this. For Brandon. Uh, three types of stones in balance. Each level poses a different challenge to balance the stones on the right with the stones on the left. The day I heard uh, Brandon had passed from cancer, I started to work on balance. Can you find the balance, the right combination? Does it exist? Balance is not really a game yet. I'm not sure if it'll ever... Uh, ever be it's buggy but playable balance is an exercise i think just like life it's rough unfinished ill-defined and when it's over i think i'll wonder what it's all about yeah, you didn't open the door for the little kid doesn't want out he just wants the option so you have to let's see if i can remember how to play this i did so you have to guide the rocks on the left to the right hand side um, and you have to balance out the, the dark and the light so what did you move already mm. I think you messed up already um, but that's okay must place those two on so the you have other one side, more right? to place um, and those are neutral stones okay. and the dark ones are the dark and the light ones are the light so you have to have the equal number of dark and light um, on the right hand side. Oh, so I need two darks. To, all right, I need two. A light and a dark. And there's already a neutral. I think it's too late, but it's okay. We'll Sorry, start Sorry, you need a light and a dark and a neutral? Neutrals count for nothing. Oh, must you place must one. Balance the light number and the dark numbers. So you only so have I one. So I could get, just put a neutral. Oh, that's yes, true. Yeah. Ah, uh, that's true. Didn't think about that. Here, three neutrals. That's balanced. It right? is worth watching the intro video on the forums, which gives the backstory and tribute for the game. Yeah, I do, uh, Carl G. I do recommend. Um, Must play zero. Or does that left hand side have to be balanced? No, because the rocks just. I don't think so. So now. Maybe. Okay, can you say that again, what I'm supposed to do? Well, we'll have to read the intro again, the intro screen, because you kind of clicked by it. Well, you said to play, so there was no. Oh, I just said turn it on. Okay, let's uh, let's no. start it again. You said go ahead, and I went okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, thank you for uh, linking the BB. Okay, click it. And we'll read the instructions. Make a path to balance the stones. Turn pieces to complete journey. Dark. Turn pieces. Those are those pieces you're turning to create the paths. Okay. Dark light must be equal, or dark light must equal, medium must be even number. Okay. So the the neutral, or the, what that you call the neutral, the medium have to be an even number. So two, On four. the right hand side? Yeah. Or do they balance with that? What, I'm con what, I, what confused me, it says to balance them. So yeah. I thought they had to have be equal on both sides of the screen. No, I played it beforehand, and okay. the left means nothing. They okay. just keep refreshing. So you over need and three over. stones in the next round. Well, it you tells you how many you have to number, place. An even number of dark and light. Yeah, and the medium must be even number. So we'll okay. so we'll take a look okay. at the opening screen. Okay, that makes more sense. So there, you have to place three. Yeah. So I can't have one neutral. No, you have to have two neutral or oh that's impossible. How do you do that? How do you place three but have an even number? Maybe it's one dark, one light, and one neutral? No, because you can't have to have even neutrals. Hmm. That's confusing. 
I don't understand. That's what I mean. It, it, it didn't quite make sense. We'll place a dark and place a light, and then we'll go from there. If you have to place three stones, there must be two mediums. Is it place at least three? Oh, maybe. Maybe at least three. That might be that might be correct, Nostalgia. Oh, that would make more sense. So let's just start a, a light and a dark, and then we'll just place more as needed. So must place two. So that's balanced. Must place one. Oh, that was automatic. <laughs> must place zero. So I would do another neutral. Because it says must place, not left. Another evening in Canada, land of the waterfalls and Atari. Yep. Oh, Ontario. <laughs> Hello to Ontario. Balance achieved. So, okay. So you must place a minimum. A minimum of three. My turn. Yeah, that makes sense. Yes. So now you have to place four, four stones. So you could do but you only have a, two. You only have a certain number of moves. Oh, that's what that's what restricts you. That's what's the restriction. See, moves twenty six, oh, and it goes down. Tons. Yeah, but I mean, as it gets harder, as you need to place more, then you have to be very conservative with your move moves. I'm guessing. So I can do um, two light, oh, two dark, and that'll be perfect. Yes. So there's a light. There's a dark. Now I do one more dark and one more light. And then it should be perfect. Makes sense. So you want to keep move as few as possible. Oh, these are moves on on the turning. Oh, I think so. Nope. No, it's good. Isn't it? No. See? Oh, movements throughout the. Pipes. Oh, so it's adding. I thought it was going down. It's going up. Oh, balance achieved. So it's so more a like score. a score, and you, you want. I guess the, the lowest number score. Minimum. Yeah, I would guess. But then you would have to play to a certain level if you needed a minimum score. Mm -hmm. uh, your turn. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's a good idea, Cafe Man 2D. If people want to, <laughs> describe your state or province or country. Oh. Be a little hard for country provinces in other countries other than U.S. and Canada for us. Um, describe your where you what state or province or country you are from using a description like Caffeman Two D said, "Land of Waterfalls," which and he gave the hint Canada too, um, which led us to oh the well, big waterfall. Canada, no, but Canada is a land of waterfalls. Is it? Yeah. I've never heard that in a Niagara Falls? That's one. Yeah, but that's... <laughs> that's one. I Name think, another I one. I think you're assuming he's talking about Ontario, and I think he's just saying, Hi, oh, Canada, us. land of waterfalls. Ah. I think you possibly... Maybe how would misinterpreted we, that. I, I probably did. So how would we describe um, British Columbia? It's a land of mountains and ocean. Constant rain. <laughs> yeah, that too. <laughs> it has been raining nonstop. <laughs> non stop. How is it? Uh, yeah, rain. So you want short paths. I'm not sure what I'm doing. I'm just oh, randomly maybe, clicking things. Maybe you want. Uh oh. Oh, that's fine. Now you have to. You have I to. I don't know why I, I, I moved the white one. I was just not thinking. I oh, was no. was talking to you and I was listening to you. I have not. to do three more dark ones. Yeah. That Well, the neutral didn't help me. Well then, yeah, well, you have to do another neutral. Yeah, now. that's okay. It's not particularly so the, hard. No, it's. It's. Kind of I a think it must be thing. more about the moves and like doing it in the lowest number of moves. It would be lowest. Because it must go to a certain level. Yeah. Not Canada, but still land of waterfalls. That's New York then. <laughs> right? Well. Well, that's where if, the waterfall. If you're falls. talking about that waterfall, then yes, but. <laughs> hey, if we're the land of waterfalls, then that's the land of waterfalls. 
Um, and I assume Finland is the land of lakes. We've got 10,000 of them. Oh, yeah. Wow. Space City, Texas. That would be uh, Houston. Yeah. Cornfields and corrupt governors. Ooh. Iowa? <laughs> I don't know. Where, is, where, is, lots where of are there a lot of cornfields? We have cornfields here. Lots of them here. There you go. Uh, and fast cars. Okay, where's NASCAR held? <laughs> I don't watch NASCAR, so I'm not sure. Let's play six stones. Oh my goodness. Uh, well, Minnesota has 10,000 plus lakes. Yeah. Illinois says Charles Wheeler. North Carolina, Indiana. Everyone's just throwing <laughs> out <states. laughs> U.S. side of the falls. Okay. Yeah. What is it? The Indianapolis 500 or whatever it is. Um, I don't know much about cars or car racing. No. Nope. I, I barely know the categories. <laughs> so not one to ask there's about cars. cars no, there's blue cars and there's No, I meant like, cars. you know, the Indy racing versus NASCAR. Oh. I, I, yeah, I know very little. NASCAR goes in a circle. <laughs> I like nice looking cars. Does yeah. that, does that? <laughs> yeah, we like silent cars that run electricity. Quiet. Yeah, I do like electric cars. They go vroom, vroom really fast. Yeah. And silently. You can sneak up on people. They don't say vroom, vroom. You go, do, 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 yeah, do. I, I, oh, God, God. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> Um, we drive up an alley to get into into where we live, yeah. and inevitably someone's walking up the alley, and because you, you, when you come yeah. out of the parkade, you're driving really slow. Yeah. And the number of times I've terrified a pedestrian because oh. I come out of the alley and the car makes no noise, Other than and I'm 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 inching behind them, and suddenly they look behind them and they jump out of their skin. They don't realize there's a car behind them. <laughs> I a find lot of that people really listen to music while they walk. Well, too. that's the other thing. People have headphones on and, they, and earbuds in. Because they it just makes me laugh. I'm not going to hit them. Just, <laughs> it's just because the car does kind of make a noise because. They're legally required to. Well, yeah, but even that is not very so noisy. So. And the tires kind of crunch. All right. Oh my God, what is happening with that shirt? Hello, D Train. <laughs> it was in relation to the first game we played, which was Bubble Bobble, because of all the fruit in Bubble Bobble. Yeah. And if bubble you can bub? see the socks. Which bub. What really... is it? Bob and Bub. Bub, bub and Bob. Bub and Bob. Bub, bub, bub and is bob. green, and Bob is blue or teal. Which is your favorite color? So there you go. One of my favorites, yes. <gasps> it has, it's lost its ranking. No, it's one of my favorites. One of. Well, I like blues. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's, okay. it's a blue. I thought that was your your ironclad favorite. Ironclad? No. Teal. I've always liked teal, but yeah. I, wouldn't, I wouldn't say. It's not your favorite. Above all other colors, I like oh, colors. Okay. I like, I like colors. I'm not that. I'm not that. Uh, I like black cats and I like orange cats. I like all cats. <laughs> What's your favorite color cat? Oh my goodness, that's a very, very... Outside of the mean... gray cat and the black cat. Outside of them? Because you can't include them, because they so are no your favorites. So no gray or no black cats, eh? No. Orange. Well, There's orange. I, I like bicolor cats, because that was, that was pixel. Stripy cats, yeah. Or cow cats. I like all cats. Yeah, fine. I like all cats. I like all cats. Yeah. I, I mean, wish, I don't like mean I cats. I wish I could hug all the cats in all the world. All the cats in the world. Um, <laughs> I don't like mean cats. And there are mean cats. Yes. That just, like, you go near them and they want to bite your face off. But <laughs> Do you think that's I've never the had cat? a really bad cat like that. I've always had very friendly. No, they're all been very nice. Yeah. I think it's the owners. What is your favorite color cat? Needs to be a poll question. Correct. <laughs> Needs to be a poll question. I like all we did do a poll way back when about cats and dogs. Oh, yeah. If people had cats versus dogs. Uh, not if they had them. If they, what they liked better. Oh. Oh, oh didn't mean to make that, but I think. Orange I... cats do tend to have catitude. Plaid Gamadev. Plaid cats. I'm waiting for someone to develop, cat. to breed a plaid cat. Oh, there's spotted cats. Oh, there are. Um can get the Bengals oh, too, which eight. look a little bit like leopards. I don't know how long this game goes on for. Okay, but we'll I do think... one more. Well, okay, you do one, one more. You do one more. Yeah. I don't know what Atari is. I mean, he is a tabby, but his his back is completely gray. And then he has kind of the Beige coloring color. of, like the pointed coloring a little bit, like a little stripey bit. Stripey tail. Stripey darkness on his tail. I don't know. So he's, he's a he's a real blend of. He's not a standard issue cat. He is. No, no. no. I, I consider standard standard issue cat like a 
brown tabby. Tabby. Okay. Yeah, so. Calico. Oh, calicos are pretty. Pretty I like cats. Calico. I like calico cats. Like I said, I like all cats. Terry's trying to get the uh, the I star, think. the Mario star. What are you doing? You silly He's kitty. trying to gain invincibility so he can steal the treats. Send the white one over. You still got lots to play. That's true. That's true. I'm like, what are you doing? Are you playing with Kitty's tail? No, playing with the star. Oh, with the star. Because the kitty's playing with the star. He's trying to become invincible. Eva D says, Calico's are notorious for purring one second, growling the next, with no event in between. So they're kind of bipolar, is what is that what you're saying? Like purr. I love you. I hate you. I love you. I hate you. Yep. Moody. Moody cats. Moody. Yeah. Carl G says, I'm rather fond of black cats. They are underrated and less often adopted from shelters. Yes. They're so cute. And and this guy. Who would not want this little floofy baby kitten here? Look, I think would... I think black cats are lovely. Adorable, this guy is. Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> Just squish him. He's so squish gentle. Squish that cat. He has never growled. He has never hissed at us. He has never bitten us. No, he is he's a never, very gentle cat. He has never lashed out at us. He's never clawed us. <laughs> That's true. He is young. He is he has time. <laughs> is that what you're saying? No, I, I young cats tend to be, I find, friendlier, and they get a little grumpier as they get older. <laughs> They're like humans. Yeah. We all get a little grumpier. They're just fed up with everything <laughs> yes. after a while. Yeah. They're like, ah, I'm just done. Yeah, they just can't done. figure out how to use the remote anymore. And... <laughs> That's right. Said PH Cat Appreciation Hour. Yeah. <laughs> Let's talk about... All the things we like about kitties. All the cats that I love. Oh. And you have achieved balance. It's a cute game. I don't know yeah. what... Pretty I mean, relaxed game. It's achieved what it's set out to do. I don't know if... Like, you know, I would, the scoring could change. There could be a time limit or something. But something... If you don't I, want it to be just... Well, no, I think I think you should have a minimum number of moves. So, oh, like a, so you should have to achieve the completion of the level in yeah. a minimum number of moves. Okay. And you could, or you could even have a ranking system if you do it under this number of moves. Like you, mean you get a gold the... star, silver star, Ooh. bronze, or fail. Do you That's know what good. I mean? I, I, that would be the only thing like I would moves, think of. Moves the way it counts moves. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That you just that would be good. You just need a ranking because otherwise there's not a lot. It's like oh, it's not hard to do. So no. you just need kind of a goal. Yeah, I think yeah. that's all you need. I think that would complete it. Yeah, because it under works blah fine. moves, you know, yes. balance place seven. Stones. And it would count down the moves. Yeah, and it would go to zero and just stay at zero if you get that, and you'd get a whatever brown star. Yeah, brown, <laughs> brown star. <laughs> you get a cat butt. You is get what a you cat get. butt. Cat butt in your face. Yeah. That's what you get. A brown star. <laughs> uh, if if you have one, you'll find yourself accidentally taking to a talking to a pair of pants or sweater occasionally think it's a cat yeah he, <laughs> yeah the black he, cats he is very camouflage yeah yeah I, it, and it's funny because you'll be sitting somewhere and all of a sudden you see yellow eyes because it's dark you know like Mink. the lights aren't on and then you're like oh there's a cat <laughs> he's just hiding in the shadows i can't find the name yeah. uh, r70 i can't find the name of whatever my childhood cat was it was like apache dark chocolate Ooh, chocolate those are rare pattern. no light colors brown at all. brown cats are very rare yeah uh, tortoise shell cats yeah those are nice tortoise cats. Shell. yes yeah the ones that are like black and orange but no white like they're they look right. like calicos but they're not i like that coloring too yeah yeah okay this uh oh <gasps> perfect timing Yay, it's party time are you ready for some party yeah since we were talking about you for like the last 10 minutes uh, yeah who who gave that rendered ghost yeah thank you rendered ghost i will feed the kitties this because Nice. I can. <laughs> Is it time? Do you want to get that bottom one out? Yeah. Put a little bit on there. Yeah. Oh, she'll just dump this on. Some cat weed. Cat weed. Okay. There we go. Ready? Show. There's another one here. here. There's another one. There you go. Good kitties. Good kitties. And he just little... flops right on the floor. <laughs> yeah, they He's need like, their own. I know what this is. Woo! They need their own because. Sprite just dominates it. Yeah. 
and tips it in the on the floor immediately. Yeah. See, they don't need much. They just stick their face in it and they're good. Yeah. So. Oh, oh, oh already rolling. Okay. Is that good? Is that good stuff? Is that good stuff? Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> they love it. <laughs> Thank you, rendered ghost. My job here is done. That's right. Now we get to bet on which cat will act the weirdest on the nip. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> they both roll around. Yeah, they'll, they, it'll hit them in a few minutes. They'll okay. be rolling around on the floor soon. Next game is Rainbow by Carrie Caxonen. Uh, this is build is from December 27th. Uh, it is a 48k game. Uh, Carrie Caxonen has also made for the 7800 Pirate Cove and Rainbow. I'm sure I'm missing a bunch. And tons of Lynx games, which I need to add to the list here. All the Lynx games he's done. Uh, you can download this one in the Atari Age forums if you want to load up uh, Rainbow. Ah, oh, so nice having an on screen menu on the 7800 GD. Lynx Jam 2023. He said, Just in time for Christmas, I wrote a new mini adventure. The game is written in parallel for the Atari Lynx and oh, Atari nice. 7800. It's still a work in progress, but I hope to have it final out during 2023. Um, so he did make this for the Lynx as well. We're going to do a Lynx day soon. Um, probably not the next show. Well, not the next show, because it's a four player day yeah, on the next show. I forgot to announce that at the top. Yeah. So I'm going to be there. Tanny's going to be there. Uh, Darcy's going to be there. And Erilyn's going to be there. This Friday, we're going to be playing 7,800 four player games. Mm -hmm. We're going to be playing Ducks Away, the first ever four player light gun, light gun Atari game. Mm -hmm. Probably the first ever four player light gun game ever. Ever, maybe? For a console. For a console, yeah. I'm sure there's some arcade, arcade ones for four sure. player yeah. gun games. I've never seen one, but I'm sure there are. This little black kitten is going nuts. Um, and we're also going to be play playing Carl G's Secret New Homebrew. <gasps> four player simultaneous for the Atari yes. 7800. Yeah. You do not want to miss this. And we're going to be playing a whole bunch of Atari 8-bit games as well using the Multi-Joy. Nice. Oh, you guys can't see that. Uh, the Multi-Joy 8. It does support eight players, but we're nice. only going to have four. Um, so, yeah, definitely tune in Friday for that. We're going to explore a lot of awesome four-player four player simultaneous games. Nice. We are going to end on Mule, which is not a simultaneous four-player okay, game. Okay, yeah, yeah. But it is a four-player game, and that's why I want to play it, because we need four players for it to, to do the whole thing. Um uh, da, 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 is a bit of work in progress. The topic of the jam this year's was to create anything using the provided sprite sheet. And it was a bunch of graphics that they gave you. Um, developers created all kinds of mini games. The entry by me and Mr. Zarnerwoop was a small quest for saving the rainbow. The game will appear on this page soon, perhaps at Christmas, and this is it. Nice. Uh, I'm still coding in different kind of mini games, but the storyline is now complete. Big thanks goes to Beastooks for creating this interesting CC7800 compiler that was used for making this game. Also to Mr. Zarnerwoop for fix fixing the language of this text adventure and, the, as, and last, the WIP binary. Uh, just three mini games still missing, Labyrinth, Whack-A-Mole, and Flying Axes. Happy New Year. The improved versions will also appear on this page as I keep updating the game until I have everything written in it that was planned. Um, and Gambler172 says, Great work. You know this game needs a dragon? And Carrie says, Yes, I know. But I hope <laughs> to learn how to mix full screen animations with text adventures to really let your dragon shine. Nice. I don't know if anybody, a lot of people are probably watching this, remember games that had graphics along the top. Yeah. And text adventure on the bottom was kind yes. of a mixed mode. Yes. Up and down. Uh, yeah. Where it was literally a mixed mode graphics um, where you would have the graphics at the top and text on the bottom. Um, besides, I wanted to make a cute, friendly, not scary at all mission close to Christmas. No blood splashing all over the screen. <laughs> I have got an overload of that stuff from the news. So the tile set that was given kind of lended itself to a violent game. And all the other games are kind of violent, which most games are anyway, yeah. in one way or the other. Um, so he went for a, a lighthearted game. Yeah. yeah, a braided G game. Half and half adventures were fun. Yeah. yeah, especially the ones where it was like a paint program where we would do the outlines and then fill them in and would go zzz, zzz. Uh, like on the Commodore did oh, that. Oh yeah, I, I love that. Did that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they weren't 
the graphics weren't stored as one big picture. They were stored as like almost in logo language. Yeah. You would like draw it. And like fill it in. Literally fill it. Yeah. Yep. Like it I would remember that. Real time yeah, fill. I remember. It's <laughs> funny. I haven't thought about that since you've just me yeah. mentioned it, but I love those. Okay. There's no instructions for this. So let's. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, by Carrie and Darius. Ooh, I don't think I have Darius's name associated Darius. with this game. Zarnawoop? <laughs> yes. I don't know. Yeah, I think Darius is our one. Uh, yeah, I don't have that associated. So it's called Rainbow. I'm in a li cozy little pond. Nice. The little girl and the frog exchange curious glances as they notice the absence of the rainbow in the sky. Oh. So that's where the rainbow's supposed to be. Yep. Or the color is gone. Yep. Uh, maybe that's the rainbow. Is that a mountain? What has happened to our vibrant rainbow lately? Uh, see, it's colored. Yeah, so you for know the, the, it's the, the frog. Voice. Trying to picture the frog out of that graphic. It looks more like a green snail, but it's got the antenna. Yeah, that's the problem. Frogs don't have antennas. Not like that. Uh, <laughs> the frog asked, it is dull and gray. Oh, that is the rainbow. And it's a bit of a downer. Yes. You can be the other voice. The rainbow <laughs> was like nature's way of saying, hey, life is beautiful. It's colorful presence. Oh, colorful spelled wrong. Oh, no. It's the American <laughs> it's way. American way. <laughs> It's that one country that spells color strangely. <laughs> the rest of the world has U's. All the U's are gone in our no. <laughs> presence as our, our always brought joy and positivity. Can we bring it back, please? Let's petition the weather <laughs> or whoever's in charge of rainbows to make a comeback. Life just isn't the same without these beautiful hues in the sky. And measures in feet and inches. <laughs> That's right. Yeah rebellious us <laughs> the U's are upside down rainbows says rc70 <laughs> they used all their U's in the name of the country yeah. united states the duo hopped off in search of answers making their way towards where the rainbow usually met the ground the fabled pot of gold was at the end i'm in a meadow where the rainbow ends i can also see a pot where the rainbow ends now do we have to type? This is a text adventure. Uh-oh. And there's no keyboard currently uh -oh. on the Atari 7800. <laughs> so this has a different way. Oops. Oh, well, we're not there yet. As they reached the spot, they found the pot looking a bit forlorn with none of its usual luster. The girl and the frog exchanged puzzled glances. Maybe someone looked the... Look. Oh. Maybe someone took the gold, the girl suggested, her eyes widening with curiosity. As the girl and the frog checked out the empty pot, a sudden tap of footsteps caught their attention. To their surprise, a troll, its fur shimmering with iridescence, uh, emerged from the pot of gold, holding a gleaming golden coin in its teeth. Uh, the troll. The girl gasped, look, Mr. Frog, it's a troll with a golden coin. Maybe they were just borrowing it for their cave. Mm. The troll, seemingly untroubled by the onlookers, ran off, going around them before burrowing in a nearby rabbit hole. The girl couldn't help but smile at the sight. So is this just a story? No, or is there... it's, there's, there's, we'll get there. Okay. Well, well, oh, that's you. <laughs> you say well, well. You're yellow. Oh, okay. I thought the blue was her. Anyway, that's just the narrator. Blue's the narrator. Yeah. We well, well, it looks like our furry friend was just adding a touch of gold to its collection, she said amused. The frog, inspired by the troll's interest in shiny things, hopped excitedly. Ribbit, I've got an idea. Let's entertain the cretins. Cretins? Cretins. Cretins. And maybe they'll be so happy they'll give back the gold coins. These guys are so positive. <laughs> so positive. The girl grinned, captivated by the frog's enthusiasm. <laughs> That's a brilliant idea, Mr. Frog. How should we entertain them? It's like definitely like a kid show where everything's uh, yeah. <laughs> awesome. The frog, feeling the magic of the moment, looked at the girl with wisdom in its eyes and croaked in a Gandalf-like tone. Oh, okay. Frodo, my dear friend, as Gandalf once said, the road goes ever on and on, down from the door where it began. Now far ahead, the road is gone, and I must follow if I can. <laughs> Ribbit. Next. The girl blinked in surprise, then smiled. Well, Mr. Frog, you're full of surprises. Let's follow the road and see where it takes us next. With a shared sense of adventure, they continued on their journey, inspired by the wise words of a frog channeling the spirit of a wizard from Middle Earth. Somebody does need to make a keyboard adapter that works on the 8, well, not the 8-bit, they have one. That's 2600 and the 7800. Um, and it 
I don't see why you couldn't and and you'd make it just like I think the Mega 7800 where it's a, a serial um, stream of information that it's expecting to receive like up down up down left right all those combinations I've proposed this before <laughs> or maybe it was something else that was using it anyway um okay next yep yeah. oh are we there yes okay now um okay calm down calm down so it's up and down to go through the options ah smart Follow. and then once you've picked one you go to the right and then pick what you want to examine what you want to look at what you want to follow so probably want to look at the pot of gold or the absence of the pot i'm in a meadow where the rainbow ends i can also see a pot where the rainbow ends oh examine the pot oh you examine a pot and i think you go to the right oh there you go the pot is no longer shining all the gold is gone Can look at the path. Same thing. Okay. okay. Uh, I think we've oh. done all that. Let's follow the road to save the rainbow. Nice. Ah, so, there looks like a, a couple path. of baddies along the way. Yeah, little challenges. Nice. So I think you just move the joystick. Oh, follow. Oh, look at the path. Yeah, sure. Okay, so, so follow just... the path. Ugh. Follow the money. Follow the money. You could try follow the money. This is not an investigation in fishy deals our politicians are making. <laughs> we should be saving the rainbow. <laughs> Focus on the target. Follow the Hilarious. money. Hilarious. This looks like a labyrinth entrance. Ooh. Okay, so you can keep following or you can enter or you can look at it. Oh, look at the labyrinth. Okay, I already gave the description. So, do you want to go in the labyrinth? Yes, do you, I okay. do. Do you? Do you? Not especially, but we'll do that. Yeah, labyrinths. Oh, oh! Beware of holes. So you have to find your way through. There is a map of the labyrinth, and with gremlin holes all over the place. Oh, gremlins. Okay. But how can we attract our audience? There are no cretins here. What? It's you. What? That's you. Spread You're yellow. Out our money on the ground to attract our audience, okay? <laughs> the frog hesitates. Well, blimey, if you think it'll work, let's give it a try. <laughs> but I hope it won't turn into a riveting disaster. I'll remember the way. Let's go. I will not remember the way. Especially if that map disappears. It's left, left. Right, it's right, left, left, right. right. Left, right, right left, right. Yeah. Okay. Oh no, the lazy programmer has not written this part of the game yet. <laughs> no gold to be found from standing still. Sigh, keep moving. Nothing to see here. Path. Yeah, it's the only way to go. Okay, we're at the next one. A tin man approaching, or a robot of some kind. Insert coin, says the rambling blue robot. Fortune favors the bold. Toss in a coin and let the reels choose your fate. Rivet, my dreams come true. A slot machine. The more you play, the luckier you get. Really? Does not work like that. Slot <laughs> machines are built to lure coins from gamblers. Yes. Spin to win. The next big win could be around the corner. <laughs> mm. Insert path. D -d 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 Animation. Art. Ooh. And a heart and a... Oh, oh congratulations. Oh, you won two coins. So we're nice. up by one. So we have 21. That's a green purse, I'm guessing. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Look, yeah, you can look at the coin. <laughs> Insert the coin. Oh, good night, Esther Ramirez. Good night, Esther Ramirez. Oh, potion. Potion? Come on, three potions. And Aww. a flask? 
bad luck. <laughs> oh, we won two coins with two matches last time. Nope. I guess hearts are lucky. Guess so. <laughs> Nostalgic says, I bet my po channel points on cats. I think it works as well as about a slot machine. <laughs> oh, that much. was a bomb. Oh, oh okay. Oh, I see. One more coin? Sure. Oh. Give it one more go before we follow the path again. Potion. Bomb. Bomb and potion. Did that? Is that good? That's bad. Bad luck. One Bombs more. Bombs are never good. We, we got to win our money back. Oh my goodness. This we is why I don't take you to, to casinos. That's right. That's why I don't gamble. <laughs> hearts. That's good. Is that one? Two coins? Three hearts. Come on. Oh, oh. bomb again. Two coins. We're back to 20. Okay. We're even. Okay. We're good. Let's follow the path to the next one. This is like the thing in Zelda. Hmm. You. You're yellow. <laughs> Don't be sad, Mr. Frog. Slot machines are not made for donating money. They are gathering the money for casinos. <laughs> uh, this is like the thing in Zelda. <laughs> All right. Boo hoo cries the pumpkin man. Oh, oh no. there's a pumpkin man. Oh my gourd, those moles are nibbling on my prized pumpkins. This is simply unsquashable. Time to scare them away before they turn my patch into a mole feast. Hey, hoppy friend, and you, dear girl with a heart as big as a pumpkin patch, could you lend a hand too? These mischievous moles are having a feast, and my pumpkins are in a pickle. I'd be forever grateful. It's good writing. Good mm -hmm. writing. Help the path. Help the pumpkin man. Okay, we chased these moles away. Please wait a few days. The programmer is still busy eating Christmas leftovers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good night, nice. T train. Good night. Thank you for visiting. <laughs> so we gotta go through the path some more. What a funny looking fella in a pointed hat. He approaches you with a salute. Good morning, lady and frog. I'm Ga Grandolf the Wise. <laughs> Today I'm thrilled to share an investment opportunity. Oh, no. That's not just about money. It's about transforming the world from the ground up. Oh uh -huh. my. Shyster. Get ready to dive into the wiggly wonders of Worm Farm, an investment opportunity that's key to sustainable soil and a richer, greener future. <gasps> Fisher's cat. No. Why invest in Worm Farm, you ask? Because these little buggers are tiny nutrient factories. They munch on organic waste, creating worm castings, the Rolls Royce of fertilizers. It's like they're serving a gourmet meal to your plants. And who wouldn't want happy, well-fed plants in their garden? <laughs> Picture this. While other investments have carbon footprint, the worm farm has a garden footprint. Investing in our worm farm means you're not just making a financial decision, you're making an eco-friendly statement. Be the change. One worm at a time. <laughs> what do you say? <laughs> Go for it. Oh, sounds a little too slimy for me. Buying stocks may be a smart financial move, and worm farm sounds like they're committed to a sustainable, <laughs> eco-friendly world. Do we have a deal? Oh. No. <laughs> oh, oh, there is no yes. <laughs> oh, bye. No. Do it, do it, do it. Buy the path. Buy the money. Buy the stocks. He didn't even mention stocks. We mentioned stocks. That's funny. Don't try to worm your way out of this. Boo. Mm -hmm. oh, Are just we going to buy, buy the stock? Sure. We invest in the worm farm. And we have no money now. Oh no! All of it! <laughs> All of it! <laughs> oh no! We bought the farm. Okay. <laughs> Follow the stock. Oh, it's oh, it's another screen. Wow. Uh oh, did we skip one? No, no. Oh, we just went There's down the path. a nasty looking lad with an axe in his hand. Uh oh. Ye daft intruder, what in the name of the highland winds are you doing in my land? I'll be not be having none of it. Get off my property before I unleash the fury of me ancestors upon ye. <laughs> and I, if you didn't move your feet, these axes will be singing through the air like a, pa a pack of angry bagpipes. Mind your step, laddie. Yeah. Still better investment than NFTs. <laughs> yeah, I was True. like, old style. And it's gone. And what it's what, what, what is that from South Park? It's the banker in South Park. And we invested it and it's gone. And it's gone. <laughs> 
You can use exchange money. For changing money from the girl's chest to the jo frog's purse. Oh, gotcha. Okay. okay, so you can you move money back and forth. She's the one who wanted it, so, yeah. I read that. Yep. This is where I'm supposed to code in a small action game with the flying axes. You are lucky to avoid this part of the game. You would have failed anyway. <laughs> okay. Chin, so. Would you have failed? I'm picking you up. I'm picking you up. Oh, ho, ho. At the troll's gate, I can also see a closed gate. Nice. Ye shall not pass until ye solve my riddle three. So listen carefully. First riddle. What has keys, piano, but can't open lock and sometimes rhymes with socks? Oh. Keys. Rhymes with socks, but it's not locks. Uh, has keys. Mm. Keys. Well, piano has keys, but doesn't obviously does not rhyme A with scale? socks. scale? No. Rhymes with socks. Um, Blocks. Uh, anybody? Help from the chat? Has <laughs> uh, keys. Docks. No, there's boats at docks. Flocks. <laughs> Again, any thoughts? Do you have keys? No. Mocks. <laughs> Knocks on the door. Well. Guess. Guess word. <laughs> okay, we're gonna Oh no! <laughs> we're gonna guess the letters. Well it's five letters. Docks. Okay. Well we're doing docks. Docks have locks. True. Yeah, docks have locks. Oh, it's not a D. It's not? No, nope, just give me an oh. X. Ooh frocks. Uh, docks would have worked. Oh, clock? Clocks don't have keys. Oh, no, it's not deleting the letters. <laughs> mm -hmm. C and D, we've guessed. Uh, well, if it rhymes with socks, it would probably have a K in it. Does that have to be in order? Docks oh, no. would have been what I would have thought. Jeez. Uh, rocks? Keys have locks. Uh, sorry. But can't open locks. Rocks. Oh, uh, the correct answer is piano. It also rhymes with socks. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, it does not. Piano does not rhyme with socks. Ah, <laughs> uh, you're right. And I appreciate the correction. The answer should have been monkey. What? <laughs> what has keys? Oh. Carrie. <laughs> <laughs> you got trolled. Oh my I'm waiting God. to be rickrolled. <laughs> yeah. Second rail, I speak without a mouth and hear without ears. Speak. Uh, I have no body, but I come alive with the wind. What am I? Uh, a kite. Uh, uh, one of those spinny wind things. Um, here. Echo? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's going to be, like, totally wrong. Oops. Chime? Chime? Echo? Oh, Echo? yeah. A wind chime. It's four letters. It's going to... A, 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 A. What are you doing? Oh, dear. Because it's good. Oh, we didn't even get a hint. <laughs> well, no, you didn't even try it. I, I said thought... echo. Four letters. It was four letters. Oh, no. I'm sorry. I thought it was trolling me again. Third, it could have been. The candle. It was four letters. But third, echo would have fit four letters. There you go. Okay. Third riddle. I'm tall when I'm young, short when I'm old. What am I? A human? <laughs> uh, could be food. Could be what's tall when it's young. One, two, three, four, five, six. Mm, tall when I'm young and I'm short oh, when I'm old. Candle. Yeah, that actually would work. <laughs> yeah, it is. Oh, wow. Wow, Gamma Dev. <laughs> Correct, the Candleman can. 
Oh, there's a paved field with a warning sign. So you only need to answer one of the questions yeah. correctly. I can also see a wooden warning sign. Caution, trespassers will be tickled by landmines. The field is not your every walk in the park unless you fancy a spontaneous tap dance. Nice. Keep out unless you have a killer sense of humor and a fancy and fancy some break dance. Nice. Uh, Enter. Oops. Oh my. Oh my. Oh. Oh my God! Am I actually doing it now? Yeah. Okay. Is it a minefield? Is it like? Is it like the game minefield? No, you're just walking through it. Oh. Yeah, oh, it, oh, it is. is. I I knew it. That's awesome. I knew it. <laughs> so, oh no, I haven't played this in a while. Well, that there's one above the top two. Where are the flags? I need the flags. <laughs> yeah, this. Ooh, can you go around it? Can't do that one. You can go around it. <gasps> oh my god. No, but you 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 can go around. So yeah, if you the 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 that one you can go forward. This one. Yeah. Or, well, the other one, too. Yeah. Okay, so it it um, it would be... Ooh, I can go up there. No, uh, yes. No, so I that can... definitely has a mine. That definitely has a mine. That black one. That's Wh definitely a mine. Which one am I so... on? I think I'm examining the one to the right. Oh, God, I don't know. So, hmm. is this the one I'm stepping on? Is the arrow? Let's assume that. Yes, you're stepping on the arrow. Yeah. Okay. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, you're stepping on the arrow. Okay, so we're good there. Yeah. And we're good at the bottom here. Okay, so that one, so that corner next to the two has to be nothing. Okay, you do it. I can't. I can't direct you on what to do. You just need to get across the minefield. I'm almost there. There you go. Yay! We did it. Look, Gandalf the Wise is here again. Good news. Due to the rainy weather, the little buggers have made a difference. Your stock has skyrocketed. Uh, no, we just got our money back. I am ready to buy them back for twice the price. Ooh. I say yes. Sell. Sell my money. Sell my thanks. Sell my stock. We Yay! sell. Oh, 60. Yeah, because he, 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 we got it back for twice the price. We sold it for twice the price. It must have given dividends. Give, yes. Gave 20 dividends. Because we know. bought 20. Yeah, we and lost 20. And then suddenly 20 appeared, and then he bought it back from us. Mm. Or did we get that for going through the minefield? I don't know. Oh, no. At some point, you'll have to guess. Oh. Dividends. Dividends. Dividends, that's right. <laughs> um... <laughs> We shouldn't we, probably shouldn't have sold it because that seemed like a pretty good <laughs> return on investment. But we got anyway. forty back. No, we started. We went from zero to sixty. We went from zero to sixty. Yeah. Yeah. So it tripled. It tripled. Yeah. Um, or else he gave us back our original. Or we money got the twenty and, by getting through the minefield. Uh, uh, maybe. Yeah. Um, okay. I'm guessing we follow the path some more. Last square in the path. Ah. Good. Okay, let's look. Oh, okay. And that's it. <laughs> <laughs> you got money from Minefield and the Guess of Candle. Okay. Oh, okay. So we do get some money. Um, at, in the meadow where the rainbow ends, I can also see a pot where the rainbow ends. Time to fill the pot with all the gold we ah. have. Oh no, there's not enough gold. The future sure looks bleak for us. End, End of, of game. game. <laughs> So Very we need to earn more gold to through fill it up. to fill it up. That makes sense. I like that. That's really cute. Really good yeah. implementation. Mm -hmm. Yep. Hi. Uh, yeah, the graphics are cute. The kittens are cute. Yes. Uh, really funny. Mm -hmm. Really good. We'll give a summary at the end of the show of all the games. Um. One more. Can we have one more game? We have Excellent. one more game. Yay, thank you. Thank you for making that, Carrie. Carrie. <laughs> and thank you for being here for it and Ooh. helping us through it. I'm looking forward to playing it again. With more of the functionality in there. On yeah? the links. Ooh, because he's developing nice. it simultaneously. So yeah. maybe he'll have more 
program actually we probably won't play this as much on the links because we have a ton of games to play from the links jam because mm. there's like eight of them or something oh and then so we'll next just play show. a tiny bit of yeah. each yeah nice um this is probably the biggest one actually yeah. all the other ones are like quick little fast action games. yeah arcadey games nice. yeah or after dark yes that's probably yes. when we'll play it next yeah we'll do a full run through when it's completed in yeah. after dark mm -hmm. there'll be more mini games in the final game awesome nice so we have one more game to play. Oh, you've sunk down in your seat. Have I? You yes. Know, you're tiny. Uh, I'm, Night I'm leaning back now. Please. Night Guy in Another Castle by VHZC. And he says, another area and another boss. Some cosmetic changes. And now it's up to 40 screens. Wow. I believe it was 40. 30 screens wow. last time. So let's reboot. Here you go, and I'll Thank load you. up the graphic for it. There's cats everywhere. Why are you so, so interested in So many cats. So what many cats. What are you cats. so interested in? If you would like to load it up, this was posted January 7th, 2024. So two days ago. Nice. It's 144K. Night Guy in another castle. Do you want to try first? Sure. Okay. Hi, kitten. You look so cute there with all the colors on you. So I don't know if anybody's noticed, but we have done something new. Um, oh. Oh, don't run into rooms. We have been starting to post our kind of mini reviews of each game we play on the show. I don't know if anybody in the chat has seen those. Um, and they are like under a minute each because that's like the lowest common denominator on all the different uh, social medias. Yeah, the shorts. Yes. Oh. It's okay. You're still safe. Um, oh, God. And people seem to be watching them. And uh, maybe that'll help like promote the games that we're playing. They're like, that's oh, that's cool. Yeah. Because they get a kind of quick overview because I kind of chop the game up into little bits of our playthrough and we do a quick review at the end and um yeah people hundreds and hundreds of people have watched them so i i'm guessing it's working they're snackable there you go snackable yes snackable reviews you miss, miss the show and you're like well i don't really have time to watch four hours of gameplay well i think that little... thing he's got uh, on there is new the graphic underneath the chest. That's oh yeah, that's very cool. It's really nice. On Instagram, I've seen them. So good, Eight Bit Poet says. Oh good. So yeah, I think people are are enjoying them, and um, yeah, hopefully it'll draw more people to the games we play, and they can download them. Or maybe they're not even aware of homebrew, and it might be a good exposure for people to homebrew because it shows the graphics off we kind of talk very quickly about it so that people don't have to you know sit through two three hours like the hardcores that are watching right now anybody who's watching right now is definitely hardcore because we're into you know almost the third hour of the show it's well we started well, a little bit late people yeah. come and go on the they, they do yeah yeah but a lot of people in the chat Let's call them trailers. Yeah, yeah. They, yeah, they are trailers. Trailers for games. Yeah. Gives Show a little trailers. quick quick overview of the game. Hi, kittens. Hi. Oh, you're cute. Yes, you're so cute. <laughs> so I've been... Um, so I made the trailers <laughs> for all the games we've played so far in 2024. Oh, and I nice. posted the last one from yes. the first show today. So the games that we played today on the show, Kitten, is playing games. What happened? Me. That killed me. What did? The top. Oh yeah, it's very deadly. Um, so we played four games today. So we will be, I'm gonna be making little bite-sized reviews of. Uh, I trust not that. Oh come oh, on! Too close. Yeah, it's this hard. This cat is chewing my hair. Kittens. Be a nice kitty. Don't chew the hair. Nostalgia says, what? I'm hardcore? Hardcore. <laughs> Instagram. I figured they would be on YouTube oh. shorts since YouTube was promoting shorts recently. Yeah, Instagram, oh, YouTube. Stop it. No, I'm starting Facebook, over. <laughs> hey, and Twitter. Posting on all four of those. 
Oh yeah, some so some people saw them. That's good. Yeah, so that they are good. Getting, some of them have almost a thousand views now. Really? Yeah. It's crazy. Uh the one that was Escape from Mars. Yeah, that I, got I noticed a lot of views. got a lot of views. It's very that one has a lot of very good visuals, right? So yeah. it's it I can see because you're looking at it, the the thing you see immediately, you can jump over there. Ah, nice. Oh, oh not far enough. I know. Oh. I was scared I was going to run too far forward. And it's also um, good social media training for me for our upcoming other show. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Because I will be making those for the other show. Gotcha. The secret show. <laughs> we'll tell you when it's out. So you may not even be interested in it. It has nothing to do with video games. <laughs> I could tell you it's a food show. It's a food, food show. It's not cat food. No, <laughs> it's not it's cat us food. Eating, eating cat food and reviewing it. Yeah. <laughs> this cat food is awful too. <sighs> this is all awful. <laughs> be surprised what people will watch on YouTube. So. Someone taste testing cat food? I bet it's, Some, uh, it's out there. It's got to be out it's there. It's out there for sure. <laughs> Pro at cooking. Cat channel. Oh. oh. You have to be so precise. Yeah, that's what platformers are all about. Especially VH set sees ones. I don't, we never really contemplated making a cat show. We kind of. Well, we kind of have a cat show. I mean, let's <laughs> be let's be show. let's be serious here. That these guys are the stars of the show. They are. It's why you come here. <laughs> games are it's secondary to the to the fluffy cats. That's right. We, we understand. The games are just filler. <laughs> they are. It's just filler in between the cats. Uh, <laughs> betting on cats. That's that's what the cat the show <laughs> should be renamed. Betting on cats. Uh yeah what 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 would be a good name for a show? A cat betting show. A cat betting show. Oh yeah, someone's got a good idea. Yeah. Someone someone out there. Has someone a good in idea. the chat. Let's just try and brainstorm. You have a cat show with a video game problem. <laughs> That's right. Um, cat gambling. Cat casino. Cat casino. Gotta have the alliteration. Always gotta have the alliteration. There's someone with a cat casino game, though, that would sue us for that, probably. Well, you always have to look up the names of your shows before. If you're gonna make a channel or some project, <sighs> always do a search for, for a, the name beforehand. Because otherwise, you're just gonna get in trouble, one way or the other. Cat races, yeah. Oh. Pro at cooking crossover with FPS, Doug. Oh, so funny. That's been, that was that's been a long time since I've thought about pro at cooking with FPS, Doug. That's so funny here. Very close. To that. Yeah. <laughs> Catsino, not bad. Almost there. Almost there. Doesn't quite roll off the tongue. Oh, hmm. you're not strong enough yet. Oh, Gotta get the power I up. Yeah, there are strength power-ups, aren't they? Oh, boy. No, I think you're safe. Oh, okay, yeah, good. You're safe there. You never know, though. Could be going further on the left than the right. More bats. Gato camp gambling. Gato, Gato gambling. Mm. Gato gambling? Yeah, that's not, not bad. terrible. That's it's not, not bad. bad. Yeah, yeah. Doesn't beat my cat casino yet. Which is still not great. It's a bit long. It's a bit wordy. Cat casino. Too many syllables. Um, oh. Catsino. Kits, casino. It's a bit weird. People would be like, what? What do you say? There, get him, get him, get him. Get him now. Okay, that's when you have to get him. Anytime he stops, just hammer on him. There you go. Oh, oh no! Ho, ho. Two lives left. Catsino. Yeah, maybe Catsino is the best. It's really quick. It it's it works, I think, better visually. There we go. There you go. Excellent. Oh, can't quite reach it. Do you have the power? No. Where do I get the power? There it There's is. There's the magical power. Yeah, power glove. Power glove. Woo! C A T O T B. Oh, that's not bad. Something like that. Oh, the wind seal has been broken. So there's wind, fire, water. Oh. 
earth. <laughs> you can kill those bats. Uh, it's just yeah. risky. They're so cute, though. Cat off-track betting. Oh, what if that could be made better? That's really good. Oh, oh I did kill it. Thunder Cat Thunder Dome. The way, that way you get two CNC letters, yes. Cats, catsino. 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 Mulet. Mulet? <laughs> like a roulette? Mulet. Mulet. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Uh, that's a good one. Yeah, that's a good one. I like oh, the cat. No! Oh. I got stuck on oh, the edge no. of it. Last life. I'm almost dead now. Oh, Last no. life. Wish you could get lives back. Well, sometimes you can't. You sometimes. Can't. They're usually in hidden areas. I don't know if he's added any yet. Mm. I didn't run across any last time, but he's added more things. I would go to the right first before going up. I don't know. Sometimes going to the right. <laughs> oh, yeah, you definitely want to go here first. Oh, no. Oh, I don't I bet remember. you do. Because that's a teleporter. No, it's not. It's a no? button. Lies. It's a teleporter. Yeah. <laughs> Puss and bats. <gasps> Puss and bats. You're funny. That's good. <gasps> There's heart. Oh, can I you get do? to it? Yeah. Oh, no, I don't think so. You can try. <gasps> yeah. Oh, full. <gasps> Fantastic. Nice. Maybe I won't have to play this. But you can make it all the way to the oh. end. This, I think, is not new yet. You haven't made it to the first boss. Hmm? Is this new? Go, 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 go. This is new. Yeah. Uh, I, I've it? never played this before, so... Oh, it's all new to you. It's all new to me. Careful. I think Puss and Bets is the best one yet. Yeah? Yeah. That's so funny. And provocative. Mm. RC70 says, I don't remember seeing that. No, this is new. Oh my god, there's so much. There's so many. Oh, that's, that's an exit. That's a one way. No, I'm just looking. I'm looking. There's an up. There's a down there. Oh my goodness, there's so much oh my going god, on here. There's so many paths. There's a down on the other side here. I don't think I want to go down. Oh, though. what is on the right hand side? No, yeah, you could go down. You can go down the. I'm going to go up first, I think. Okay. That's not too bad. Oh my god. Uh, I can get across that, but I can't come, get back. You'd be going back the other way. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, oh it's a Mario level. Oh, you're going to go back and forth. Oh, careful, careful, careful. Don't go too far. Okay. Okay, good. No, we did, I, we did do this. Yeah? We did this one. You yeah. remember this? Yeah, I do. Oh, too close. It happens. Yeah, this is the barrels in Donkey oh, Kong. God. I get caught under things. <laughs> I'll be careful with that name. You might get some people not thinking cats. Yeah, that's that's the thing. But provocative is not a bad thing. Oh, God. You know, it'll get some people tuning in, and most people love cats. There's a little apple there. Mm. Oh, my God. Does that give you help? Yeah. If you can stab that guy at the top. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, it's Something easy. You just walk under and you're safe in the middle. Oof, kind of close though. It's, there it's, go. It is close. <laughs> so, it, is there an up to that too? I bet That's there is. the exit. Going back. Is it? Oh no, you have to go under and get the apple. That's right. Well, and then come back through. Yeah. Middle is probably easiest. Oh, oh so close. <gasps> Oh, gave you one life. Okay. Now, you could try and stab that guy, but I would. That's what I would do anyway. Yes. Ooh, a button. A button. A timed button. Just like on EXO. Run! There you go. Oh, boss time! Oh I don't know my what to god! Do. You gotta hit those ah, things! Ah. Careful! What Careful. things? That button on the other side. What? What? What am I hitting? The button on the other side. Oh no! 
Oh my god, this is terrible. Do you want to play it? Sure. <laughs> I'm just gonna die. <laughs> oh my god, I just died. Splash damage. Oh my god. It's art. Oh, I know. Jump over that. Oh, okay. You just have to go back and forth. Yeah. <gasps> it's okay. Oh, no, no, you have to hit him with it. Oh, it drops down. Yeah. I just got lucky. Then. You got lucky that time. Oh, no, what <gasps> no, am I doing? No, you can't stop. You have to be on one edge or the other. Okay. At least you're protected there. Yeah. Oh, you see, you're doing what I'm doing. It's the so timing. hard. <gasps> oh, oh, you got him. It's got a nice big wide hit <laughs> hit box. Oh, no. It's hard. Did you get to him before? Or no, new? this is new. He, oh, so this is the we're second at least boss. we're seeing the new boss. Okay, got him. I got through the first one. <gasps> How many hits does this guy take? Lots. <laughs> Too many, probably. There yeah, we go. Whoa, two hearts left. Can I get a refill? Oh, it's the end of the demo. Oh, refill. Up to seven, right? Eight? Nine? Oh, yeah. yeah. I Woo. like that. Woo. Thank you, VHNC. <laughs> Thank you, VHNC. That was brutal. I wonder if it's a full refill every time. Well, oh, this is the end see. anyway, so. Oh, the fire seal has been broken. Yay. That's two. That's all there is, because there's the second boss. Oh, but, well, there was a whole area I didn't go to, if you want to backtrack. Oh, yeah, there's more that we haven't seen yet. I wonder if I can trigger it again. Boom. Yeah. I'm sure I can hurt, hit myself with it if yeah. I want to. Yeah, I'm sure you could kill yourself. Get up there. Get up there. Oh, it's gone forever. That's nice. nice. That is good. You kill him immediately. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, you, I think... This way? I think you have to get up, so I think you wanna you wanna be on the upper level. It is challenging. Yeah, I yeah. think you wanna go up. That's not too bad. So we've done all of that. Yeah. Yeah. But we haven't gone down. No, and and I hit that transporter and there's another side to that, obviously. Yeah. Good thing you got the extra life. Um th that's closed off, so so oh, we didn't go down, and yeah. there was also, I went through a transporter. We went that way? No, yeah, can't go that you can't way. go that way. Okay, yeah. so I have to go down the vine. Now, that last time I thought it was dropping. <gasps> I did see this one last time. Oh, yeah. But it's actually... It's a mesh. It's a mesh, like in um, Super Mario World. Or, what is it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's Pong. It's Pong. It's Pong. It's Pong. It's Pong. Oh. Down, 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 down. Wow. Whew. Okay. And then... This is a uh, bouncy. Oh. Oh. Oh, I remember oh, this. Oh, wow. I remember Duck. this. Remember where... <gasps> no! It's fine. You don't die. You just do you just it again. get to do it again. Oh. It's it's not easy. It took me cute. a lot of tries to do this. This is so cute, VHC. So, this is a new mechanic he's never done before. I know. Oh. It's to the right. You have to go to the right. To the right? Actually, to get that. No, you can get that. You just have to sneak your way between them. Dramatic pause. Yes. Dramatic pause. Nostalgic. Damn oh, it. you were holding on to that one. You can try it to the right, too. Dramatic pause. Dramatic pause. Oh, you got it. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't... I mean, you got the pause and... How do uh, you get there? I think you might have oh. to go around. Yeah. I think, or I mean, you probably can, but... Actually, I could pop the balloon and land on that platform and get it. Oh, what am I doing? Captain Classic to appeal to the French Quebec population. Paris Le Chat. Bet the cat. <laughs> Bet the cat. Yeah. Oh. I wanted to do that. Okay. Nice. So I can get that. So I lost a life. <laughs> now I'm back up to nine. Now I can go up. There. Now you're really going to try. Now I'm really going to try. I forget where it is. There it is. Oh, now you're on this side. 
vicious fishes. Vicious fishes. Oh, that's a good name for it. Ooh. Oh, yes. I remember this. Okay. Okay. Last time we played this, it crashed on this dolphin screen. Oh, okay. And that's where we stopped the game. Um, and I think he has fixed it. He He's had people play it that haven't encountered it. Well, you didn't play this that, that second um, boss before, right? True. So that whole area was different. So. Yeah. Okay, is that snake? You got it. You, you hit the snake. Yeah, you can run right into the snake. Stabby stabs. <laughs> we were making jokes last time. Oh, 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 we did do this boss. So we did the second boss first. This is a boss? Yeah, it's turtle boss. I can't remember. You probably have to stab him? Oh, oh he, water. Okay. Water, he, he squirts water when he does the exclamation mark. And I have to jump over those and kind of, and then stab him and then get out of the way. Okay. And then shoot. I remember this not being too bad after you figure it out. Once you get the timing. Yeah. Oh, he shoots one far and one close. Far, close, far, close. My goodness, takes a lot of stabs. <laughs> He's a yeah. very well armored turtle. Oh, turtles have natural armor. That makes sense. It's one of those bosses that looks really scary, but once you get the pattern, he's really not too bad. Ooh, More hearts. I have all the hearts. Do I get 18? I got 10! Woo! Whee! Whee! <laughs> Speech bubble's cute. It is. It is. Cute. Oh, oh my god. Yep, Deadly just... duck. Swan. Swan's just looking at me. So this is the third seal. <gasps> the water seal. So actually, three seals have been broken. Hey, quit looking at me. Quit, quit looking at me. Oh, step, step, step. He Hi. thinks you're talking to Oh, him. no. It's treat time. the cutest. Time. Oh, oh, old style. We will let the game sit on this screen. Yes, because nothing bad is happening. Yep, it's a safe screen. Cats don't play with the joystick. He's like, ha ha, if you don't give me treats, I'll play with the joystick. Okay, get that. Yep. Hi, baby. Put the catnip away. They're all nipped up. All right, so let's see. The duck's there just to make you nervous. It did uh, make me nervous. I didn't know what was going on with that duck. Okay, predictions have started. All right, so let's they're a little high on the catnip, so on who? The, they're on the down slope of the catnip. Yeah, so, you know, they, their performance might be a little affected. People have theorized that Atari does better on catnip. I think that's true. And I think it is true. Yeah. At least a little bit better. Yeah, I think he holds his nip a little bit better than uh, Sprite does. <laughs> yeah, he's young. He's young. He's not as experienced with it. <laughs> He's only new to it. He yeah. only uh, became accustomed to the catnip at one year old. Yeah. <laughs> and now he loves it. Mm -hmm. But he's still very un inexperienced. Yeah. Puss and bets time. Yeah. Puss and bets. <laughs> yes. That's a good one. Puss and bets. <laughs> Puss and bets. Performance enhancing <laughs> drugs. Or diminishing drugs. Diminishing drugs. <laughs> and you can just hold it better. Yeah. Puss okay. and bets. Puss and bets. <laughs> Oh, so oh, cute. So Performance cute. debilitating <laughs> drugs. <laughs> Thank you, old style. So mm -hmm. we got about a minute left in the betting. Okay, kitties. Are you ready? Are you hyped? Do you want to get the door? One's mm -hmm. distracted. Not yet. Not yet. Almost. Almost. 30 <laughs> seconds. 30 Here's seconds. Those. Yep, we still got time. Still time to put those bets in. Yep. Oh. Put in the bets. Put in your bets. Let's Place see. Bets Let's see what the bets are like right now. Uh oh, nothing on Atari 3 Plus. Oh, there is. 10. Oh, somebody snuck in that little <laughs> tiny 10 bet. A lot it's, of confidence in Atari. It's a long one shot. Two. But it's worth putting in 10 if you're not confident on anywhere else. Yep. Lots of Atari oh, one yeah. two. Oh, yeah. they think Lots you're... of Atari on one two. They think you're Got lots do it. of confidence in you. They think you're gonna pull it off. Got a lot of confidence in the kitty. Eighty-five yes. percent of the bets are on that. Wow. We got five seconds left. 
Oh, oh, oh he pawed your foot. Oh, that's a good sign. Yeah, that's a good sign. Everybody's checked out the cats before the race. Okay, you ready? Hey, pseudographics. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Just looking at the chat. They're in their pens. Yep. All, All right. right. Go. Nothing. Nope. Oh, oh, Sprite. Sprite got it. Come on, Atari. Ring the bell. Ring yeah. it. Ring it. The <gasps> bell. Don't disappoint no, them. No, oh, don't do this again. Harder. There okay, that's one each. One each. There you go. Just Oh, you gotta Sprite's, eat faster. Sprite's right back at it. Oh, he missed it. Come on, Atari. Tied up. There you go. It's tied up. Two, tied two. Up. And they're off. Cats are gearing up to the gate. Oh, there's Sprite. Sprite. Three, two for Sprite. Atari's close behind. If he can ring it. There, there we you go. go. Three, Weak, three. but it was there. Oh, there you go, Sprite. Four, three. Atari's very Atari. close behind. He's catching up. He's catching up. Oh, Sprite's so fast at eating. <gasps> that was a very soft touch, but it did make a noise. Harder. There, there you go. go. Five, five. Glad these bells make a different sound. Yeah, I do. <laughs> there <laughs> no. you go, Sprite. <laughs> Not encouraging Sprite. He's too good already. There we go. Six, six. He's just behind. If you could go... Oh, ding, ding. Oh. Oops. Uh, if you go just a bit faster, Atari, you could make it. Come on. Oh, 7-7. Seven, seven. We're getting close to the end. Coming around the corner. 8-7. Come on, Atari. Keep it up. Come on. Oh, double ding from Atari. Maybe he can do it. Oh, he didn't go far. Hit the bell, Atari. If you can do it, you can pull it off. He's got interference. He's got his butt over the bell. Hit it. Hit it. Oh! And Atari's got 9-8 to eight at his game point for Atari. Can he do it? Sprite looks stunned. He's Oh, he oh, did bring it. Oh, there's 9 one more Atari. ring and he's got it. He's missed it. <laughs> hit Get the, it. Hit, hit the, the bell. bell. It's hurry. It's Atari, hurry. hit the bell. Come on. He oh, did it. he got it. He did it. <laughs> Atari won. Atari has done it. <laughs> oh, by one. One. <laughs> so close. Oh, my goodness. So close. Oh, so close. You did it. Kid. Nice. Hooray. He does win sometimes. <laughs> But just barely, like <laughs> that close. Just inches in there. So Atari won by one, and there is the results. Yep. So two thousand, twenty-three thousand. Wow. Captain Classic and Rendered Ghost. Two people. Wow, big pot what? to All share. What? Wow, they put a lot of they, money on that. Wow, you had big confidence oh, no. in Atari. Oh, says Charles <laughs> Oh no. Nostalgic. <laughs> This is what I get for being disloyal to oh, Atari. No. Oh, I love how no. Sprite just stared in the distance for 30 <laughs> he seconds. Did. He did. He's definitely more influenced by the catnip. He did. Yeah. He just sat there. Just da dazed. <laughs> Completely dazed. No. Oh. Poor kittens. Okay. Oh, Let's get so back to the funny. game. Sprite was patient for Atari to move out of the way. <laughs> Now, Atari did put his butt over all the bells. He was at, standing well, at over some them. point, at some point. Yes. I mean, that doesn't help him, yes. but it does hinder Sprite. <sighs> so I don't think there's any more bosses. So I think we just go back to the gates. Okay. And uh, and then and, that's and the, end the, of the teleporter demo. area. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <gasps> oh, oh you can okay. go all the way across. Oh, keep going. This is where it crashed last time. Oh. Right on this screen. But it looks like he's fixed. Ah. <gasps> uh, well, at least you start up there. And I have 10 lives. Oh, so you do have to go back up here, right? And then so you leave. can get here. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Ah, I bet that other place is open. Now it's open. Ah. So is this a full game? Is there a fourth boss or no? Oh, this isn't the full game yet. Still Imagine working. the chaos if you got a third cat. There we go. Yay! End of demo. End woo. of demo. Woo, woo, woo. Do, do, do. We showed it off. Nice. Very, very good. That was fun. That was very fun. I killed a boss. You killed a couple of bosses. Yeah. Yes, it would be chaos. I think three is... I have a thing about being um, outnumbered. Three cats? <laughs> Way chaos. Especially yeah. for the cat games. Yeah. yeah. We, we've never had three cats. No. Two max. One minimum. Yeah. But two. Two, they have to two have is a pretty good. I think having a friend is they have is, to have a buddy because we're not for always cats, home, and they they keep each other kind of interested. So 
Yeah, they and chase they, they each play, other. They play, and they get used to each other, so, yeah. 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 Oh, good kitties. Very good kitties. It was one each. Yeah. Sprite won by a mile in the first round, and Atari snuck it in. Just snuck it right in there yep. for the second round. So. Yep, yeah. so they both they both won. Pretty, Pretty even. Good. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, yes. we played four games today. Yes. Bubble Bobble. Oh my god, of course it's amazing. amazing. I know it's still in that kind of development mode, but it yep. plays really, Nine really levels. well. Nine levels. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's colorful. It's got the amazing music. Uh, it's it's full of sprites. The whole screen is <laughs> just full. So yep. Old Style's done an incredible amazing job of job. that. Yep. And I can't wait to play more levels of it as he develops it. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Balance. Uh, very uh, small game, but um, it has a little bit of puzzle elements to it. Yeah, it reminds me of like uh, what's what's those, like those pipe, pipe games, pipe games yeah. uh, where you have to funnel, you know, the, the the fluid to the other side. But it's got that plus a little bit of um, a little bit of strategy, a little, little bit, bit of, of strategy. Yep, yeah, and I yeah. think a little tweak, a couple tweaks. Uh, can make it into a, a more challenging game. Yeah, I think it just needs a challenge at each level. Yeah. It needs something that you're striving to achieve because it's not hard to complete it. Yes. Um, but it's my, right now it's a zen game. There's no way of losing. Yeah. You would just keep playing and keep amassing moves. So it'd be cool if there was like a goal. An end goal. A, and a goal for each level, yeah. yeah. Um, but no, really fun. Play is fun. I like it. Yeah, yeah it's a good game. Rainbow, a uh, great text graphic adventure. Yeah. The writing is so cute it's and so really cute. well done. <laughs> Carrie did such yeah. an amazing job yeah. on that. Yeah. Um, it's kind of halfway there right now. Some of the parts aren't there. Some of them are. Like the individual little mini games that you play yeah. along the way aren't it's all like there a yet. Text adventure mini game compilation with funny right clever funny writing and you can see the seed of what it will become yes so it's it's a really fun yeah so i look I forward to the later iterations playing the full game yeah yeah so we'll play it again yeah for sure night guy in another castle uh of course vh said he knocks it out of the park again <laughs> he's updated it with a second boss yes the graphics are just stunning the gameplay is amazing the variety is all there all the the regulars are there from VHZC's yeah. bag of tricks. He's got the Pong in there, of course. Yeah. Um, yeah. VHZC at this point is like his own, I don't know what universe. you would call it. The VHZC There's universe. There's a VHZC universe. This is just another addition to a wonderful series of games. And yes. again, it's he's still working on it. He's still yeah. adding to it. He's got two bosses but now. It but it doesn't disappoint. It's <sighs> it's as much fun as the other Night yep. Guy games, so can't yeah. wait to play it when the third boss yes. is added. <laughs> yeah, yeah, very good. Yeah, excellent. so yeah, really great batch of games today, as per usual. The community is always so creative and inventive, and um, I can't wait to play. Wait to play four player day on Friday. That's gonna be awesome with all the co hosts here. So uh, and we're gonna. <laughs> card out the CRT as well yeah. for the first game with four player light guns. Never been done before. Ever. Yeah. I'm just, <laughs> I, I might have like a seizure because it's going to flash so much on the screen, yes, but it'll it be is. fun to play. It'll be yeah. a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah it's going to be a lot of fun. And of course, <laughs> Carl G's uh, secret mystery game, four player mystery game on the 7800. Can't wait to unveil that. Yes. And a whole bunch more four player games. I'm so excited. This is going to be a lot of fun. I uh, hope the weather doesn't like throw a wrench into any plants because it's, it's supposed to be very cold and snowy, Yeah. which causes a lot of problems in Vancouver because we're not really a place that, that gets a lot of snow. But so. Darcy will be here early enough, I think. I and, hope so. And Erilyn's close by. Yeah. So, so hopefully, hopefully it'll all be good. But uh, and then we'll just sit here, we'll drink hot chocolate and coffee and play yes. four player games. So yep. stay nice and cozy and warm. And after that next Tuesday, we're gonna be maybe doing Atari 8 bit day, but okay. that might be pushed. I might do the links. So it might be either links or Atari 8 bit. So those are the okay. two next shows after the Friday. Yeah. Um and I probably get start doing some after darks now. Mm. Now that I've kind of through the the really rough patch for the Atari Homebrew Awards where I have to organize a bunch of stuff. Now it's not as bad. I have to do mostly graphics preparing okay. for the actual event. Yes. But that's 
a month and a half away. So I just kind of have to start planning and start slowly doing it. Um, so one of the uh, After Darks is going to be Raiding Rivers. Machine has offered okay. a patch for that. Okay, okay. So I've already put in our scores we've done. Remember we played Raiding Rivers a yes. little while back? Oh, yeah. So I put in our patch scores. Nobody else has submitted any yet. Okay, there you go. So we're number one and two yeah. <laughs> so far. He didn't say nice. how many patches he ma he's going to make. Okay. But he usually makes quite a few. He's, okay. he's the patch guy. Oh, nice. The homebrew patch nice. guy right okay. now. Um, but we'll definitely put in um, some more scores. Yeah. And I've got a whole roster of After Darks. Oh, and nice. I might start doing some After Darks during the day. Well, you're not here. Yeah, you were mentioning that. Yeah, yeah to get through Just, a few things. Yeah. yeah, I will reserve penalt for both of us. Oh, good. I think because that's more fun with two people. Yeah, I think because so. there's maps and there's planning and strategy and yeah. stuff. Mm -hmm. um, but I think there's a lot of like high score things that I that I can do on mm -hmm. my own during the day, and so those will be purely random. They will not be scheduled. So if you want to know when those are happening, just follow this channel. Yeah. And it'll just pop up on your phone if you have Twitch on your phone. <laughs> if you don't have Twitch on your phone, it won't pop up anywhere. <laughs> and then you'll be alerted to when I'm just uh, jumping on. Nice. Um, but um, the uh, sixth annual Atari Homebrew Awards nominee reveal is the next big thing for the Atari Homebrew Awards. That'll be on February 2nd. Nice. That means when all the nomination committee has whittled it down to six per category. And we'll see who is the top of the top and who you'll be voting on, the public, starts then. And uh, that is a Friday, I think. Uh, not sure. Let's check that out. It is a Friday. So the voting starts on the, that Friday. Excellent. And uh, then we play through all the nominees. Boom, that boom, boom. is awesome. Yeah. Yeah. The best of 2023 kind Always of. Always so It's a 2023 wrap up yes. almost. Yeah. 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 Um, of course, there's really good games outside of those six, but mm. those are the top six games in each category. Um, and then uh, the Atari Homebrew Awards live presentation, the big event of the year. That's on a Saturday. Yeah. It's February 24th. Yes. We get all dressed Yay. up. We move out of this room. We have a green screen. Yeah. Uh, we've got it's all the co-hosts there. It's going to be a lot of fun. Nominee playthrough shows are a lot of fun. They are because that just reminds us how good the year was right. for homebrew. Uh, I guess the part of the appeal uh, for you is not having to schedule them officially. Yeah, the After Darks. It's just I have time. I can jump on. Yeah. I can do it for half an hour. I can do it for two hours. Whatever. It, I don't have to schedule it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and it gives more flexibility in terms of being able to do more After Darks because I've got a huge list that I need to get to of After Darks of games. They're mostly games I want to get a high score in, but most of them are I want to get to the end of the game mm. and finally finish it. Like, let's just take a look at some of them here. Um, Attack of the Petsky Robots. I probably want to play that with you. Mm. Do you want to play that one? Oh, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. that's... Yeah. that's that's, That's a puzzle, fun. a puzzle action, action game. Yeah, yeah. And you like the puzzle ones. Robot Z, I'll probably play by myself. Um, that one's hard as hell <laughs> <laughs> to get to the end. Uh, when I was beta testing it, I think I got about halfway through mm -hmm. the game. Then it gets really hard. Then the Alien Abduction Hero uh, Load Runner, we'll play with you. Always love them. Um, Ro Robex and Ridiculous Reality, those are both puzzle games. Mm -hmm. Play that with you. And then there's just a bunch <laughs> that I just <laughs> need to get list. to. Big list of fun, like fail safe. I can do that on my own too. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, lots, lots of after darks uh, to do. Um, oh, also, did I schedule that? Yeah, developer spotlight in March on Steve Engelhart, Atarius Maximus. Mm -hmm. He's got dozens of games yeah. that I didn't even know about. You were saying you, you put the list together and you, you couldn't believe how long it was. Yeah, I had a smaller list and I said, hey, am I missing any? And then he went, yes, <laughs> <laughs> you are. Here's all the games I made. So uh, we'll be doing that sometime in March um, after the Atari Homebrew Awards and a small break after that because it just burns me out. Yeah, it's, it's a, a lot big, of work. It's a lot of work. Then I get to so make all the work. awards and I can Yay. hopefully get those done. So. Yes. So thanks for tuning in. Mm -hmm. uh, Carl G. Chitlila. See or no reboot. Uh, oh, Rocketeer Rebounced demo. Yes, that as well. Oh. That's coming up. Nice. That is uh, a bouncy top... Uh, 
top-down bouncing game. Kind oh of thing. yes, yes, yeah. yes, yes. Uh, pseudo graphics. Oh no, you missed the whole show tonight. <laughs> Time to rewind. Yeah. Uh, or watch it on YouTube afterwards. Dan ABC, Rendered Ghost, Carrie, thank you so much for making that mm -hmm. awesome game. Looking forward to uh, the extended version of that. Uh, Chow Stony Mao, Double Down, Old Style, thank you for Bubble Bobble. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I can't wait. So, so cool. Yep. Uh, 91, 91 more levels to go, he says. <laughs> That's not too bad, is oh, it? No. No. <laughs> it won't take any time at all. Uh, Gamma Dev. Dan AVC, who Captain we Classic, uh, uh, Chitlet Law, I think you mentioned already, Caffey yeah. Man, Cyrano, I'm repeating names now. <laughs> yeah, a lot of the same people. Uh, chatty, chatty, chatties. S. Oh, Ramirez. S. Ramirez just sneaks in there. And the D train, uh, D -train at the top yes. as well. Excellent. Um, yeah, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. Yeah. And we'll be back on Friday. Oh, special time on Friday. <gasps> it's at 2 p.m. Yes. Not noon. Yeah. Uh, so check the schedule. Check your local time listing <laughs> in your TV guide um, for the time where you are. And uh, and uh, that's it. Yeah. So have a great week, everyone. And um, stay warm because yes. it's going to snow here. and It's going to be there's... cold in a lot of places. Someone in Illinois was saying they got a snowstorm today, too. So. Oh, yeah, I've been watching, you know, U.S. news, and there's snow all over the eastern <laughs> yeah. side. The right-hand side of the continent is snow, 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 and it looks like the west coast is getting snow now, too. Yeah. So it's all snow. So stay warm, stay inside, have mm -hmm. some hot chocolate or whatever hot beverage you yes, like. Yes, hot beverages. So uh, we'll see you on Friday. All right. Bye, everyone. Bye. Have a good night. Bye-bye.